Pokemon, I am invincible. When I dig out the Udman's fossils at the beginning. Author, Ultraman Zeta. Chapter 76 Next stop rival, Giovanni. Unlock the Alola underground. Meanwhile, Vermilion Jim, Dragonite, Dragon Rush. Commandum, who has evolved into the final form of Dragonite, charged at Blaine's Charmander. Dragon energy covers the body surface of Dragonite, forming a substantive blue energy stance. Fire Blast. The duckbill fire dragon spit out a mass of flames in the shape of a large character from its mouth, aiming at Dragonite, and quickly dodged sideways. In the air, Dragonite does not dodge or dodge. Zan Blue Energy collides with the crimson flame in the shape of a big character. Boom. Explosion sounded. The flame offset part of the dragon's energy. The blue energy position wrapped in the Dragonite body has shrunk a circle, but Dragonite still made the charge. Even if the duckbill Charmander started to move ahead of time, it was useless. Dragonite discovered his trajectory early. Boom. Dragonite's body is like a cannonball, smashing the duckbill fire dragon into the ground. The violent dragon's energy is fully released. The duckbill fire dragon instantly fell into a coma, and the surrounding earth began to be torn apart under the scouring of energy. The dense cracks continue to extend to the edge of the field. This battle is won by the challenger. The battle is over. Marzishi immediately announced the result. Hey, I'm getting old. Two consecutive losses, shaking his head helplessly. Blaine retracted the duckbill dragon. Give the cinnabar badge him. Thus, the badge of Yi Bei Ying has reached 7. There is only one badge left before entering the competition. Really nice rookie. Everyone sighed. Unexpectedly, apart from the special existence of Yi Bei, Malto has such an amazing potential. Not only mastering a Kingdra, also possesses pure quasi god Dragonite. Two Dragon Pokemon. In contrast, most Pokemon in the team are flying Pokemon, Yu Longdu, who is known as the Dragon Elite. Everyone looked at Yu Longdu who is known as the envoy of the dragon, with joking eyes, that unspoken tacit understanding, Yulongdu, who knew what everyone was thinking, gritted his teeth, bastard, I'm not a flying elite, when the matter came to this point, everyone should leave separately to deal with the follow-up disaster relief matters, but among them, obviously not including the tragic death of Trump card, the early retirement of Agatha, Agatha elite wants to take him as an apprentice after learning that M has a thousand year old ghastly, train her into a ghost type elite, whose dream is to become a dragon master, naturally refused, separate from the alliance crowd, only Annabelle, Serena, and Ma left beside Yi Bei, Yi Bei, let's just chat, apologetically, he exchanged a glance with the two women, Annabelle pulled Yi Bei to an uninhabited corner, your next stop should be the Viking gym, that's right, speaking of Chengpan gym, Yi Bei showed a serious face, there is news from the countermeasure headquarters that a fatal blow will be launched to the Viking gym in the near future, this plan will be carried out in the evening after three days, I wanted to tell you about this, well, then I will go to challenge when the time comes, and I will hold him back, Yi Bei's answer made Annabelle slightly taken aback, no, Annabelle refused, why, Yi Bei was puzzled, the lava team that came to Kanto was destroyed by the rocket team, according to the information and the materials we obtained at that time, in team rocket's hands, they hold a legendary level superpower beast, Mutuo. These two words instantly appeared in Yi Bei's mind. In short, three days is still a long time. Let's talk about it when the time comes. Although it is dangerous to face a superpower beast. But now after inviting Cynthia and Annabelle to join the underground world, Yi Bei may not be able to be within three days. Find a psychic type legendary Pokemon to defend yourself against. Okay, let's talk about the underground world. What exactly is this? Out of business. On Annabelle's exquisite and beautiful face, he retreated seriously, full of curiosity and doubts. Facing Annabelle's inquiry, Yi Bei didn't feel strange because Annabelle guessed that it was him who initiated the invitation. But still feeling as expected of Interpol, you found out so quickly. After a pause, Yi Bei continued. In simple terms, the underground world is a different world where there are no humans, only Pokemon and precious items. Find a safe place, and you will see for yourself. All right. Annabelle thinks Yi Bei's statement is correct and true knowledge comes from practice, agreed upon, the four of them left the gymnasium and came to the nearby Pokemon Center, as a result, the Pokemon Center was overcrowded, there was no other way, the group of four had no choice but to come to a nearby hotel, under the astonishment of the young lady at the front desk, open dot 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 a room, partying, huh, why don't you call me, little big brother, can you add me, a good looking person has about 7 out of 10 points, come to Vermilion Harbor Beach, want to find a handsome guy to relieve the heartache of the bikini lady, Zero dot 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 seeking flowers zero. Attracted by Yi Bei's good looks and good figure, he volunteered to recommend himself. Walked up to the four of them. The young lady pressed her left hand on the counter and leaned forward slightly. Two touches of white snow and ravines are reflected in Yi Bei's eyes. With a glance at the truth, it was identified as pure waste. This scale is far worse than that of what's the meaning? M and Serena didn't understand the reason for the woman's visit, and there was a cute and puzzled expression on their faces. And Annabelle's face darkened. I'm afraid it's not just a reason. 
the estrus came to the Interpol, excuse me, lady, you seem to have misunderstood, we are not the kind of relationship you think. Yi Bei rejected the lady's request to have a party with a strange expression. Really don't think about taking me one? Dot 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 zero. A girl in a bikini, but only thinks that Yi Bei is not interested in her appearance. The heart is even more unwilling. Mr. Yi Bei, you don't want to get halfway through and have Officer Jenny break into your room, huh? A threat, huh? My girl, your thoughts are very dangerous. Yi Bei unzipped his clothes playfully. This scene fell into Miss Bikini's eyes, and she couldn't help swallowing, are we here? Could it be bad? That being said, but Yi Bei I saw a trace of excitement in the other party's eyes, well, it's still a freak. Yi Bei I took out a small notebook and a pair of silver bracelets from his inner pocket, sorry, you were arrested for insulting Interpol. Give the other party a look at the certificate in his hand. Yi Bei I directly handcuffed him. Soon, Officer Jenny came, but instead of kicking open Yi Bei I's door, instead, he took away the bikini girl who was suspected of being a satyr. In addition, Yi Bei asked Officer Jenny a few words, find out if this lady is taking some hallucinogenic substances. Came to the room as I wished. At this moment and Serena finally reacted, that woman is really disgusting. Who would have a party in broad daylight like she thought? Although I really want to tell the two women, this phenomenon not only exists, but also many. But Yi Bei I, who didn't want to talk too deeply on this topic, took the initiative to change the topic. Leave her alone. Let's go to the underground world. Invited target Annabelle was detected, entered the underground world, and has been matched and unlocked Alola Underground 10. Chapter 77 Lusamin and Ultra Wamhole Underground World Yi Bei I gave Annabelle a detailed introduction of various information about the underground world. Like Miss Serena, after experiencing the baptism of the underground world, Annabelle soon became obsessed with the underground world of various magical phenomena. But, the arrival of Annabelle, even though the corresponding level of the Alola Regent's secret realm has been unlocked. But since there is no secret base, Yi Bei I still needs to go to Alola himself, leaving a secret base there, in order to facilitate the capture of local Pokemon in Alola, Yi Bei I separated from the three daughters, with Rayquaza, embarked on a trip to the Alola region, underground world, in the Narcissus secret realm, Raikou, Thunderbolt, instruct Raikou to knock a large group of level 45 Kingalas to the ground, Annabelle and Raikou smashed through the entire Narcissus secret realm, after going through a lot of battles, he couldn't help Raikou get a level increase. The Pokemon level here is still too low for Raikou. Annabelle looked for help to the two stunned women behind him. Are there any higher level secret realms in this 140? Dot. Paused. Looked at Serena. Look at each other. Swallowing. Serena continued. It's just that it's difficult to compete with Raikou in combat power. Sister Annabelle. No problem. As long as it's higher than here. Okay then. We'll take you to the underground of the Unover region. Talking room. Um, summon the teleportation device. Just getting ready to target Unova, suddenly found, on the teleportation list, there was suddenly an option for Sinnoh. Sinnoh region? M and Serena looked at each other with hesitation. Didn't you have this option before? Annabelle looked curious. No. The two girls shook their heads together. Then how about we go and see? Annabelle suggested. Okay. An agreement was reached, and the three of them went to there. Sinnoh region? Mountain mystery. A fierce battle has just fallen in Veilstone. Cynthia made a difficult draw against Pillar King Regagagas by commanding Mega Evolution Garchomp. Garchomp's level has thus been raised to 91. A true masterclass. It's been a long time since I experienced such a bloody battle. Right, Garchomp. Cynthia, dripping with sweat, tossed Gold's hair sticking to her scalp. He looked at Garchomp, who had regained some of his physical strength through potion treatment. Lei Yao. Garchomp looked at the huge fallen Pokemon in the distance. His fierce eyes were full of fighting spirit. Give her encore and she'll be confident she can beat Regagigas before she falls. What to do with this Regagigas? Cynthia scratched her head, thinking of the battle just now. Regagigas didn't show too much power of a beast. Presumably this is not the Regagigas who has comprehended the authority of the law. If you subdue it, this shouldn't be too much of a problem. Right. Why not? Let's wait until we meet Yi Bei I and ask him. Just that way, when this Regagigas wakes up, it will inevitably vent its anger on common Pokemon. Thank you Garchomp. Drive away the wild Pokemon that are still wandering around. Cynthia directed Garchomp to carry out the aftermath. In fact, the work is not onerous, for as early as the battle begins, most of the wild Pokemon fled far to the edge of the secret realm because of fear. There are only a few scattered Pokemon that dare to stay nearby. Garchomp cleared the trouble with ease. Let's go, let's change to another secret realm and continue fighting. I brushed Gold's long hair behind the ears, Cynthia kicked her legs and jumped behind Garchomp. Finally, reluctantly hovering in the sky for a while. After admiring the whole picture of Regagiga's huge body, Cynthia and Garchomp flew out of the mountain mystery. I plan to go back to the secret base first, treat Garchomp's injury, and then go to the next secret place to explore. When she comes to the secret base, when you are about to study how to use the healing machine, 
It is located opposite the healing machine. The hatch of the transmission device just opened. Cynthia, it really is you. The moment she saw a head of beautiful blonde hair come into view again, the corners of Annabelle's mouth rose slightly as a strong woman. Just now he guessed that maybe Yi Bei I invited Cynthia together, and the scene in front of him just confirmed his guess. Officer Annabelle. And and Serena? Cynthia stared at the three of them in astonishment. Brain running fast, reminds me of the introduction to the teleporter. I'm curious. Are you guys in Sinon now? Forget it. The blonde-haired Serena nodded. Among the people present, only she knows best. The teleportation device in the secret base allows one person to go back and forth between two places quickly. The doubts in her heart were resolved, and Cynthia couldn't help being a little curious. Why are you the only ones? Isn't you bay I hear? He? Something. Went out. M and Serena looked at each other, looking at each other, not knowing what to say. Yi bay I invited Annabelle, the two of them at least knew about it. But what about Cynthia? Yi Bei I should not be familiar with Cynthia. This, okay. Yi Bei I dragged him to the underground world, but he didn't come to see him immediately. This surprised Cynthia a bit. By the way, you guys came just in time. I need your help for something. Cynthia brought the three daughters to the mysterious mountain. Looking at the huge figure that fell, the delicate red lips of M Serena, and Annabelle are all neat and uniform, showing an O shape. Meanwhile, Alola region, in the artificial island of Ether Paradise, Ether Foundation Branch Chief Zobo. A wretched man who likes to wear a pair of green glasses. In order to win the favor of Lusamin, the widow's female president of the foundation, let him see the ultimate beast of his dreams, Faber did not hesitate to coax Lusamin's daughter Lily, takes Cosmog, a legendary Pokemon cub named Nebula, from Lily. Attempting to use the power of Cosmog to open the Ultra Wormhole to summon the Ultra Beast. After putting the small Nebula into the energy device, with the energy provided by the small Nebula, Faber successfully opened the Ultra Wormhole. A jellyfish-like body with a translucent contest condition and a jellyfish ultra wormhole surrounded by some white hexagonal marks on its head, appeared in a laboratory on the lower floors of the foundation, floating in the air, curiously observing everything around. I did it, Lord Lusamin, look, I did it, Faber dialed the phone excitedly, in the office, Lusamin is in charge of dealing with investors one by one, looking at the content on the screen, there was a little astonishment on the fair and beautiful face, and the mouth watering red lips lifted slightly, what a beautiful creature, Lusamin is similar to Cynthia, they are all beauties with golden hair, However, unlike Cynthia's facial features, which are more oriental, Lusamin's facial features are more western, full of exotic style. And, comparing the two, Cynthia's hair, though long, is at least normal. But Lusamin's gold hair is not. Not only is it long and fluffy, like an eggshell, wrap her whole body in the middle. Then, as a survivor, Lusamin's figure is taller than Cynthia's, like overripe beaches, waiting for the master to pick it, has matured to perfection. Amazing without feeling overly grown up at the same time. No under 2.4 even has a child. It can still reduce Zobo to a licking dog. Which area are you in? I'll come over now. Just as Lusamin hung up the phone and went straight to the destination, Yi Bei and Rayquaza have just arrived in Alola region sky. The four island gods and the main god of Alola region were watching in front of them. They are, Tapu Koko, Tapu Didi, Tapu Mu, Tapu, and standing on a mountain below, Tapu, who was the mother of the rockets in the sun and moon chapter is raging. All five Pokemon were watching Yi Bei and Black Rayquaza very vigilantly. However, without waiting for the two parties to communicate, if you feel it, all Pokemon, including Rayquaza, turned their attention to Ether Paradise in the distance. Wu Tapu whimpered and flew over the first. The other Pokemon also followed in their dreams. What happened? We don't even care about it anymore. Out of curiosity, Yi Bei immediately patted Rayquaza on the head signaling to follow. Let's go and see too. Chapter 78 Lily's Explosion Lusamon is taken away. Ether Paradise, underground, the red experiment area that Zobo is in charge of, surrounded by textured or airberg walls and load-bearing columns, each area has a separate metal cubicle. The rooms look exactly the same. The overall style of the building is simple and full of edges and corners. At a glance, it feels very regular, sweeping across rows of cold and hard or airberg buildings. Niligo glanced around curiously and finally came back to the only living creature, human wretched man, Bowbody. Covet Nialago, who admires beautiful things, expresses his disgust for this world. Getting ready to go back to the ultra world through the ultra wormhole, suddenly, a man and a woman, two figures came into Nialago's eyes from a distance, it is Lusamon's children, son Gladian, and daughter Lily. I heard from my sister that Pokemon was snatched by Zobo, as the big brother, Gladian brought the main Pokemon Silverly to question Zobo. As soon as I came here, Lily saw the small nebula in the machine that was suffering from energy extraction. Little nebula. Lily O3 anxiously ran forward, trying to rescue Xiao Xinyun. Get out of the way, Lily. Gladian's voice came from behind. Lily quickly dodged to the side. Silverly, crush claw. Silverly has a bird-like head, two eagle claws like a large bird, a feline body with two hind legs, 
and a fish tail. Silverly's limbs swing as fast as a bolt of lightning. The front paws were raised, emitting a dazzling white light, piercing the air, tearing the energy cabinet that bound a little nebula. Little nebula. Lily didn't care about the shattered glass shards, and swooped to catch the small nebula that was about to fall to the ground. At this time, Nyalago, who is flying in the air, has his eyes on Lily, who has a beautiful and cute appearance, a worthy body. Nyalago couldn't wait to jump from the air towards Lily. Silverly, air slash. The blue wind blade cuts through the void and hits Nyalago. Nyalago only felt a pain in his abdomen. The body was slammed into the wall by a huge force, leaving a huge depression. It's okay, Feng Hai. Forced to retreat Nyalago, Gladian rushed forward to help his younger sister Lily who fell to the ground. At this moment, Lusaman is long overdue. In the middle of the mess, Gladian is helping Lily, not far away. There was a dumbfounded Zobo standing. Lusaman was full of doubts. What's the matter, Gladian? Lily, why are you here at Zobo? You have to ask your good subordinate. As soon as he saw Lusamin, the mother, Gladian was overwhelmed. Do you see that you have fulfilled your duties as a mother? Who will take care of Lily when she is in danger? Where have you been? You only know to be busy with your work and take care of Pokemon, so why did you give birth to me and my sister, Gladio? Lusamin was speechless for a while, but didn't think about it. Even Lily, who has always been a caring little padded jacket, gave herself a head-on blow at this time. On Lily's fair and delicate face. There was a flash of unbearable and entanglement, but in the end she firmly believed, I dot 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 I hate such a mother. Lily, Lusaman was stunned, she never thought that one day Lily, who has always been a caring little padded jacket, would yell at herself like this, I've done so much, isn't it to give you a better life, isn't it to find your missing father as soon as possible and provide you with the lack of fatherly love, enough, Gladian interrupted Lusaman's rebuttal, that's no reason for you to ignore Lily at all, if so, after work, why don't you try to cook by yourself? Why not try picking out Lily's clothes for school herself? Why don't you take me and Lily yourself, and also go out on occasional outings like the common family? Have you given us enough motherly love before making up for the lack of fatherly love? I, Lusamin, this strong woman who built a big consortium by herself. At this moment, he was left speechless when asked. The eyes are dull. As a mother she is indeed very unqualified. At this time, Nyalago, who was blown away, was surprised when he saw Lusamin. I suffered a loss last time. This time, she didn't immediately fly to Lusamin. Venoshock. Nyalago is aimed at the direction where Silverly is, spit up a lot of venom, caught off guard. A lot of purple's venom covered Silverly's head. Silverly lost his vision for an instant. Take this opportunity. Nyalago quickly approached Lusamin, covering her body. Silverly, are you alright? Gladian looked at Silverly with worried eyes. Silverly shook his head, shook off the venom, and gave Gladian a reassuring look. My lord, Lily exclaimed. Get Gladian and Silverly's attention. What's the matter? Lily, look. Lily stretched out her delicate white hand, pointing to the floating in the air, Lusaman whose eyes seem to have lost their luster. Since you don't like me, farewell, Lily, Gladian. Lusaman's voice came out, the figure flashed, and got into the ultra wormhole connected to the ultra world. No, my lord mother, stop, you can't leave, Chairman Lusaman. The three present realized it later, hastily shouted to stop Lusaman, but it was too late. The figure of Lusaman has entered into ultra wormhole, and study the mouth of the ultra wormhole with the entry of Lusamin, it is also slowly closing. At this moment, the ceiling enough to withstand the attacks of Master Pokemon was violently broken, Tippet blazingly fell from the sky, followed by the four island patron saints 057, coming down from the broken ceiling. Just saw the tragic scene. They all sensed the aura of the Ultra Wormhole and came here because they wanted to drive the other party back to the Ultra Wormhole. However, it was too late after all. One human being has been persecuted. Tipu Wu, please, Tipu Koko. Please save my mother. Seeing the four island gods appear, Lily quickly turned her eyes to the patron saint of the island for help. Looking forward to getting the desired result from the other party's mouth. This time, however, Lily was doomed to disappointment. As patron saint, the Tupu family will have great power only in the place they guard. If you go to another world, you will lose their legal authority. In addition, the tsunami that endangered the four major islands occurred some time ago. They don't worry about leaving here at all. Turned around and wanted to leave. At this time, rumble. A bigger hole broke in the ceiling. A huge black dragon head came into view. The three people present held their breaths, forgetting the grief and anxiety in their hearts. Suddenly, a red light enveloped Rayquaza's body. Soon, Rayquaza disappeared. Immediately afterwards, an extremely handsome male figure descended from the sky. At this moment, that handsome face was full of embarrassment and apology. Sorry guys, I forgot to tell Rayquaza not to force his way in. Rest assured, ceiling, and grand I will pay. Dot. Chapter 79 Traveling Through the Ultra Wormhole Take down Guard Voyeur The Guardian Angels of the Island are all vigilant. Originally planned to follow up on Ultra Wormhole, but worried about the safety of his sister Lily, Gladian stopped in his tracks, 
Lily and Zobo were all dumbfounded. You dot 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 are you the trainer who subdued Rayquaza? Thinking of the news I saw not long ago, Gladion opened his mouth unconfidently. It's you. Can you take a photo with me and sign my autograph? Farbo excitedly ran to the next table. Take out a small notebook and a camera, like a rabid fan. You will ask for autographs and group photos. Wait, we don't want you to compensate for the economic loss here. I just hope that you can help me save my mother within your ability. Can you? Lily ran over in a hurry, pointing to the ultra wormhole that was slowly closing in the air while running. Period. Xiao Xini uncooperated and bumped Zobo away. Boom. Zobo's body, like a sandbag, was thrown out by fling. Forehead. His eyes swept over the three people in front of him. A little non-mainstream boy Gladian, with his trump card Bokum and Silverly, a mad scientist with an obscene appearance and a fanatical fan attribute plus a veteran dog Licker Farber, and Lily, a cute girl who likes to wear white stockings, and the little nebula floating beside her. Combined characters, Yi Bei quickly glanced around again, and the ultra wormhole gradually closed above, recalling what Lily said, Yi Bei finally knew roughly what happened just now. Thinking of the teleportation function of the underground world, Yi Bei's eyes brightened, doesn't this give him a chance to establish a connection with the ultimate world? I know you're in a hurry, but don't be in a hurry. Yi Bei stretched out his hand to stop Lily, who was approaching him anxiously, covering his chest with both hands. Yi Bei consciously dives into the underground world, first build a secret base underground in the Alola region. Consciousness returns to the body. Okay, this matter is on me. A mere cross-world rescue will not trouble him at all. Come out, Guard Voya. Summoning the beautiful figure of Guard Voya with different colors, Yi Bei pointed to the hole above. Come on, Guard Voya. Let's go in there. Good host. Guard Voya's generous hands folded together. Psychic launch. Wrap Yi Bei and rush into the ultra wormhole before it closes. Soon, with the disappearance of Yi Bei and the different color Guard Voya, the ultra wormhole is finally closed. The island patron saints left one after another, and there were only three people left on the scene. He. He actually followed in. Lily pointed to the place where Yi Bei disappeared. His eyes widened in disbelief, and he said with hindsight, Wait. Guard Voya of a different color. And his appearance. Could it be that he is Yi Bei? It shouldn't be wrong. That beautiful Guard Voya was almost the same size and appearance. Gladian, who has already quickly pulled out his mobile phone, found Yi Bei's social account, and opened the video about the different colored Guard Voya's battle, affirmed. If it's Yi Bei, there must be a chance to bring back my mother. Yes, I hope so. Gladian, who didn't have much hope for this, said some words against his will. I just hope that this can soothe Lily's delicate heart. At the same time, Gladian also admires Yi Bei very much, for such an unknown dangerous thing, it was so easy to agree. In his opinion, Yi Bei's promise is definitely not for exempting the compensation from the ceiling. After all Yi Bei who owns Rayquaza, even if they choose not to compensate, they have nothing to do with Yi Bei, not only without any complaints, also choose to take the initiative to make friends with Yi Bei, this is the reality. But Yi Bei would like to, under such circumstances. The reckless help they need to help. Yi Bei's behavior, is simply too great. At the same time, ultimate world, Yi Bei opened his eyes and found that the picture he saw seemed to say that he did not open his eyes. This is a world that has lost its light. In this world, common people or common Pokemon are like blind men who lost their eyes. You can only rely on other senses to sense everything around you. Fortunately, there is still air here to meet the needs of living things. Otherwise, Yi Bei had no choice but to abandon the rescue plan. You can only enter the underground world directly and return to the original world. Hope my soaring in the sky blessing doesn't expire. Yi Bei tries to communicate the laws of flying. Surprisingly, Yi Bei still got a response from soaring in the sky on this planet. Look down on this land by soaring in the sky. Yi Bei finally saw where he was. Now, he and Guard Voya are on a vast rock plateau. About a kilometer away, there is a cliff. And Lusamin possessed by Nihiligo has already flown 10,000 meters away. Found it. Yi Bei looked in the direction where Lusamin and Nihiligo were. Behind energy dual wing beat stretch. Hold me. The moment Yi Bei spoke, Guard Voya hugged Bei tightly like a sloth. Energy dual wing beat fanning. Under the blessing of the authority of the law of flying, Yi Bei's speed is almost to the point of teleportation. Next second. The figures of Yi Bei and Guard Voya appeared in the air ahead of Nihiligo and Lusamin. Question mark Nihiligo? Rock plus poison, question mark ability, floating, talent, purple, question mark level, 75. This ultra beast is the common Pokemon of another world, not because it is linked to legendary Pokemon, has gender, and ability is no longer a unified beast boost. A more perfect body, sensing the strong aura of lore coming from Yi Bei, observing Yi Bei's handsome appearance, longing for the perfect Nihiligo, immediately flew to Yi Bei with Lusamin, she wants to fuse Yi Bei and Lusamin to create a more perfect life, psychic. The poison system is restrained by the super energy system, in addition, the level exceeds one level, 
Yi Bei directly handed over the battle to Guard Voya. Light Blue's arms are folded together, and the eyes are covered with a layer of light purple light. Invisible confusion waves, quickly attack Nihiligo. Boom, Nihiligo, who was floating in the air, suffered a heavy blow and fell towards the rock ground behind him. Guard Voya attacks wave after wave, Nihiligo has no ability to resist at all, and soon loses the ability to fight. The gel-like tentacles also slowly let go of Lusamin. Bodies land next to the fallen Nihiligo and Lusamin. Due to toxin invasion, at this time, Lusamin had fallen into a coma. If the other party cannot be invited into the underground world, Yi Bei had no choice but to take Lusamin and find a wider cave. Inside the cave, Yi Bei found a relatively flat rock surface, and placed the soft body in his arms on the rock. At the same time, Yi Bei found that Lusamin's breathing became weaker and weaker. Let's treat a dead horse as a living horse doctor. Yi Bei opened the system backpack and took out a bottle of full restore that could restore Pokemon's stamina and remove status condition at the same time. Part Lusamon's red lips and pour into it. Only, Lusamon under the coma contest condition will not swallow, or nose, liquid at all. Yi Bei had no choice but to use his mouth to blow air into Lusamon's mouth and send it into her belly. This is of course impossible. The situation has not yet reached such a critical moment. Yi Bei asked Guard Voya to use mental power to send the medicinal liquid into Lusamon's body bit by bit, and always pay attention to the other party's reaction. During this period, feeling Lusamon's gradual recovery of steady breathing, Yi Bei breathed a sigh of relief, but, when Lu Summon contest condition is normal. The pain and torment brought by the toxin also caused Lu Summon to continuously groan in a melodious tone, evocative voice, coupled with the daydreaming scene at this moment, it made Yi Bei very uncomfortable. Guard voice stood aside, seeing everything in his eyes, his gemma-like pupils were full of emotion. Question mark master, do you want me to help you relieve stress, huh? Oh? Zero. Yi Bei was slightly taken aback, sweeping across the dark and astringent environment but she still remains beautiful, full of noble temperament, with fluttering skirts and a good figure of different colors. Guard Voya returns, this can have it. Chapter 80 Lusamon wakes up, the beast of the ultimate world. In the dark cave, Guard Voya is soft and smooth, sweat dripped from Guard Voya's brow, time flies by, 100,000 meters away from the cave where Yi Bei and Guard Voya Lusamon are located a valley, a great riot is taking place, a huge Pokemon is furiously attacking the surrounding human-sized Pokemon indiscriminately. Electric currents, beams of light, Dark particles, all kinds of remote means have destroyed the valley in devastation. Thousands of Pokemon fled in all directions. These escaped Pokemon are all one type, earth like bees. The body is mainly purple, like two rounds of crescent moons behind, with spiked wings, a round belly, and a long spike below the abdomen. And the huge Pokemon, its body is entirely composed of black crystalline materials, and its pitch black appearance seems to be able to absorb light. The body covered with spikes is enough to make the enemy bleed once it gets close. Its hands are huge, each with three sharp claws, and a diamond-shaped barb on the back of the hand. In contrast to the huge palm, its arms are very slender, the legs of the lower body are slightly thicker than the arms, and there are three forward spikes on the soles of the feet. The weird thing is, of all the fleeing bee Pokemon, none of them attempted to counterattack. All are fleeing in tacit understanding. Even though Annihilation was under the attack of a huge Pokemon, he didn't try to resist. After several companions sacrificed their lives and died. Other bee Pokemon are able to hide. With no target to attack, Black's gigantic Pokemon Rage spits out a large number of light particles from its mouth. The beam of light will destroy and disintegrate everything along the way, creating an absolute vacuum of nearly a thousand meters in front of you. Done these, Black's huge Pokemon rose from the ground and flew towards Yi Bei's direction, continuing to kill to vent his anger. After it leaves, bee Pokemon reappeared one by one. An older Pokemon showed weakness on its face, God Lucas. At the same time, Yi Bei who is devoting himself to increasing the bond with Guard Voya, naturally has no time to supervise this world, not knowing everything that happened in the valley. Woo. In a daze, Lu Summon felt water stains next to his lips, so he stuck out his tongue and licked it. A bit fishy, the taste stimulation woke up Lu Summon. Open your eyes in confusion. According to common sense, the cave is pitch black, she should not be able to see anything, but now, Guard Voya's psychic overflows, the whole person is like a humanoid desk lamp. Lu Summon instantly saw the whole picture of the surrounding. The line of sight falls between Yi Bei and the heterochromatic guard voya, eyes widened in disbelief, amazing scale. Lu Simin, who has not experienced the joy of this place for many years, had an instant reaction, cough cough, feel more dry mouth, the morality in her heart made her make a difficult decision, facing the searching eyes of Yi Bei and guard voya, Lu Simin braced herself strongly, I dot 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 I'll wait for you outside the cave, leave a word, following the faint light emitted by guard voya, Lu Simin came to wait outside the cave. Sitting at the mouth of the cave, feeling the cool wind blowing past, Lu Simon's restless heart gradually cooled down, the brain kicks in, thinking about what happened, but she couldn't remember at all. 
her memory is broken, in the last second. He was still being reprimanded by Gladian and Lily, and after his eyes went dark, he opened his eyes and saw Yi Bei and Guard Voya in the next second. What the hell happened? Where is this? Sweeping around, I can't see girl's environment in the pitch black. He raised his head and looked at the soaring in the sky, which was as dark as ink. I can't see anything, but I can hear the wind whistling in the distance. Lusamin felt a burst of fear for no reason, subconsciously turned around, glanced at the shining cave, doesn't this really attract other creatures? Thinking of the dangers you might face, Lusamin moved back quietly again, and came to the middle not far from the innermost part of the cave, the closer to the depth, the brighter the light. The fear in Lusamin's heart dissipated a lot, but as the light keeps swaying up and down, the melodious sound enters the ears. The psychological torment is gone, but the physical torment has come. And, remembering how close I was to the two when I just woke up, Lusamin blushed for a while, how shameless to do such a thing in front of her face, and fell on her face, the key is that she still let it, the more I think about it, the more ashamed I become, Lusamin hastily stretched out her hand to cover her burning face, helping her to cool down physically, but, one thing to say, Yibei I didn't do this to her when she was unconscious, at least character can be guaranteed, this made Lusamin slightly relieved, as for other aspects, with her experience, releasing stress in time is not an outrageous thing, but normal, and the marriage between Gardvoya and human beings is legal in some regions, Lusamin naturally doesn't care, only, I don't know if it's because of being possessed by Nialago, Lusamin found that the current self has a special pursuit of perfection, it even gave her the urge to combine covet with Yibei, if she hadn't been strong-willed as a strong woman who created a large consortium single-handedly, and she still cared about her children, perhaps she will indeed get lost under Nialago's influence, but, it would be nice if Yibei could give Georgia and Lily the missing fatherly love, enough, Lusamin, you are a lady, how can you have such dangerous thoughts, while Lusamin was in a mess and her thoughts were flying, it's been over half an hour, the bond cultivation with Gardvoya is over, Yibei I invited Lusamin into the depths of the cave, although I have made a decision in my heart, I will no longer associate with this matter, upon seeing the scene of the crime, coupled with Yibei's handsome appearance, after Gardvoya is moisturized, it will fully bloom, like a delicate rose contest condition, Lusamin licked her delicate red lips uncontrollably, Zero dot 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 seeking flowers zero. Also because of this action, thinking back to what I just licked with my tongue, on Lou Simmons white, tender and translucent beautiful face, the corners of her mouth were pursed in dissatisfaction, her emerald eyes were full of resentment. During this period, the line of sight is always unconsciously cast down, if it's yourself, how good it is, no, you can't do this, you have a daughter and a son, shook his head, feeling that her thoughts were becoming more and more uncontrollable. Lusamin pinched her thigh, let's talk about business. Hi, I'm Lusamin, the director of Alola region Ether Foundation, may I ask who you are? Yi Bei I, Carlos. Yi Bei I replied, the face is not shy after being seen by Lusamin. Having been a human for two lifetimes, his mental age is far older than his current body, so it's not too embarrassing. Yi Bei I, where is this place? Why are you and I here? You don't remember? Yi Bei I was surprised, I just remember going to the underground testing area, meeting Gladian and Lily and then I don't remember it. By the way, they are my son and daughter. Thoughtful, Lusamin added shyly, this is because she felt that her resistance to Yi Bei was low, so Lusamin pinned her hopes on Yi Bei, trying to prevent Yi Bei from making mistakes by letting Yi Bei know in advance that she is a married woman. I know about it, mom. Yi Bei explained, it was entrusted by Lily that I will chase after you into the Ultra Wormhole to find you who was taken away by Nialigo. About Ultra Wormhole, Lusamin widened her jewel-like pupils in astonishment and there was a trace of surprise and fear in the corners of her eyes, surprisingly, she finally arrived at the ultimate world where the ultimate beast exists, fear that, it's pitch black, it's not suitable for living at all, and, they may never go back, thinking of being left in another world with Yi Bei and being influenced by Nialago, Lusamin's thoughts are messed up again, at this time, boom, there was a loud bang, the cave where Lusamin, Gardvoya, and Yi Bei are located shook for a while, immediately afterwards, the entrance was blocked by collapsed boulders, dust hits, Guard Voya Psychic activates, blocking the dust from approaching, looking at the huge rock that fell from the entrance of the cave where I was before, at the same time, loud noises from outside continue to reach the ears of the three of them, the earth under the three people's feet in the top of the cave above their heads are also constantly shaking, there is quite a sense of oppression that may be smashed down at any time, Lusamin subconsciously hid beside Yibei, tightly hugged one of Yibei's arms, making him sink into softness, looking at the hole where the boulder fell, Lusamin silently swallowed, so close, if she just stays there and doesn't move in, it is estimated that she is going to be turned into a meat paste now, only, now that the cave is sealed, it won't be long before the air in the cave will be exhausted, things didn't get any better, what the hell happened, in the confusion, Lu Simon turned her help-seeking gaze to Yibshi, the only reliance at the moment, dot,
Chapter 81 Legendary War, Mom Please Hold Me Tight, Communication Law Authority, by Soaring in the Sky, Yi Bei I saw the scene outside, two giants are fighting each other, a crystal Pokemon whose main body is mainly black, the other one looks exactly like a bat, and the lines on its body seem to be engraved with a piece of Minister, Necrozma, and Lunala, the cover god and the third god of the sun and moon chapter, in my impression, the settings of the two are somewhat similar to the three dragons of the Tao, just like Zekrom and Reshiram, which represent Yin and Yang, are part of the ice dragon Kyurum, the sun god Sargalio, who has a similar setting, and the moon god Lunala are also part of the Lucas god Necrozma, although both settings are similar, however, Necrozma, the great Lucas, has a much stronger expression than Kyurum, who is known as the strongest dragon. In its heyday, the god Lucas created a world, this is the ultimate world where Yi Bei and Lu Simon are now. It is basically equivalent to the Alpaca Arsuis with a low profile version with a separate world view, while there's no way to touch the multiverse class of porcelain llamas. But from this aspect, also as the creator of the world, Lucas, the great god Necrozma, must be far stronger than Kyurum, as for May 10th. If Kyurum can achieve a feat that has never been achieved in the game, and at the same time fuse two first level gods of Yin and Yang, can he reach the level of Necrozma? It's not easy to say, but one thing is certain, at that time, the title of the strongest dragon must be worthy of the name. Never get slapped in the face by Magraquazu again. Yi Bei, Lu Simon looked worriedly at Yi Bei who was in a daze. I'm fine. He turned his head and gave Lu Simon a reassuring look, and then Yi Bei looked at the strange guard voyeur. Guard voyeur, destroy the death ray. Okay, guard voyeur is just about to unleash a destructive death ray to destroy the boulder at the entrance of the cave. As a result, the next second, his legs were so weak that he almost fell down. It was Yi Bei who reacted faster and stopped Zoshi Shanjuo who was about to fall. You are too tired, go back and rest first. It can be seen that Guard Voya has released too much mental power just now, lead to exhaustion. Yi Bei put away Guard Voya with a Pokemon Ball, as red light envelops Guard Voya, collect it into the Pokeball. Without Guard Voya's protection, in the dark cave, nothing can be seen, but still can feel the earth and the top of the cave trembling. Pieces of rubble fell from above. If Yi Bei hadn't been like a tumbler to provide him with strong support, by now Lu Simon had already fallen to the ground. Subconsciously, in the dark, Lu Simon tightened Yi Bei's arm. Yi Bei, what shall we do now? Feeling the strength of Lu Simon's arms, knowing that Lu Simon is very nervous, Yi Bei stretched out his hand and patted the back of the beauty's white and smooth hand. Mom, don't be afraid, I'm Prime Minister Kao, and I will definitely protect you. Lu Simon, why do I know every word you say? but I can't understand it together. Although Yi Bei's words are somewhat inexplicable, but behind Yi Bei's disturbance, the tension and worry in Lu Simon's heart dissipated a lot, and Yi Bei took advantage of this moment, released three air slash towards the boulder, with Feng Grui's air blade cutting the boulder, in the gap, a large amount of air is poured into the tunnel, the energy behind Yi Bei is fanned by dual wing beat, hurricane, blessed by the power of the law, the berserk Horatio rushed towards the shattered boulder, blow away the boulder blocking the cave's entrance directly, Rumble. The boulder rolled out towards the outside and hit the ground, making a loud noise. Hurricane blows the dust away. The light of the moon from Lunala, the god of the moon, shines into the cave. What happened? I heard a loud noise, and a hurricane blew up around me. Lusaman just subconsciously buried her whole body in Yi Bei's chest. This bang goes away. Immediately raised his head in doubt, and looked at Yi Bei who was close at hand. I cut the boulder. Yi Bei said frankly, What? Lusaman couldn't believe what his ears heard. But don't believe it. A human being can cut through a boulder of this size, moreover, Yi Bei was motionless by her side just now, this is simply a joke. What time is it, you still tease me with such a joke that is not funny at all. Lu Simon rolled her eyes resentfully Yi Bei, it revealed the charm contest condition that had never appeared on her body for more than 10 years. But what I say is true. Real, eyes facing each other, looking at Yi Bei's sincere eyes without any hesitation, Lu Simon was amazed. At your age, with this kind of acting skills. It's really a pity not to go to Hollywood to compete with Kaluni for dinner. Yi Bei is also a little helpless. To tell the truth these years, he has not been trusted by others. It is really difficult for him. At the same time, the two huge Pokemon above are still fighting. A large number of light particles spew out, emitting astonishing heat and strong light. The light of this piece of heaven and earth flickered, and the heat temperature rose sharply. The movement of the two fighting also aroused Lu Simon's curiosity. A movement on this scale. Could it be that a legendary Pokemon is fighting? Yi Bei, should we go out and take a look? Although the heart is very covet went out to find out, but after paying attention to the land and sea battles some time ago, she also knows the danger of legendary Pokemon. Simply hand over the right to choose to the backbone Yi Bei. If you want to see it, go out and have a look. Don't worry, with me covering you, even the legendary Pokemon can't hurt you. I found that you are a good person. Lusaman's tone was faint. What? Yi Bei was curious. 
your mentality is really good. In this case, you are not nervous at all. For this, Yi Bei I could only show a helpless expression. Rayquaza, Groudon in hand, Yi Bei I really doesn't need to be too nervous when dealing with a crippled Lucas under contest condition. Contrary to Yi Bei I's attitude, facing about to walk out of the cave and see both sides fighting, Lusaman subconsciously hugged Yi Bei I's arms tightly, allowing them to penetrate deeper into the elastic advantage zone. For the performance of Lusaman, the evaluation given by Yi Bei I is rich and generous. The two walked out of the cave, when he raised his head and looked into his eyes, he saw the two sides fighting in the air. Everything is consistent with what Yi Bei I saw through the authority of soaring in the sky. My god, it's incredible. Lu Simon's delicate red lips parted slightly, and she let go of Yi Bei I's arm with her right hand, covering her mouth. This is Lunala, and you, Inky, huh? Yi Bei I was slightly taken aback, have you seen them? Yes, in Alola. It is a pity that the two appeared too hastily at that time, and did not have time to leave a picture, unexpectedly. They arrived in this world and are still fighting. Lusaman watched the two legendary Pokémon in the battle with fascination. Ariel, Lunala is very depressed at the moment. Since they have their own independent consciousness, they don't want to be swallowed up again. Together she and Solgaleo, made an appointment with another sense node of time and space. The island patron saint in the Pokémon world degenerates Solgaleo into an infant, and then cultivated by potential trainers in that world, in order to get help from that world. Without sacrificing both of them, help Necrozma's gain the power he lost. Unexpectedly, Necrozma, who lost his mind and fell into a rage, found her in advance, and chased her to the Pokémon world. After returning to the Ultimate World, I have been looking for her, now I have found the place where she used to hide, if you don't want to get out as soon as possible right now, it is estimated that she will not be able to wait for Solgaleo's support, and will be swallowed by Necrozma in advance. But this time, she can't sense the space nodes of the Pokémon world. It means that she will not be able to escape Necrozma's pursuit by jumping through the space. Despair gripped Lunala, once again through the Phantom Force, behind Necrozma, knock it down with a full blow. Inflicted a heavy blow on the earth, Lunala flew over the heads of Yibei and Lusamin, and fled towards the distance. Struggle up from the ground, Necrozma quickly caught up. Soon, Yibei and Lusamin fell into darkness again. Yibei, we, Lusami 2.6 Chennai is a little overwhelmed, I don't know whether I should follow up or not. He looked at Yibei for help. She doesn't have any Pokemon with her, so she can only rely on Yibei now. Of course it is to keep up. Yibei replied in the affirmative. Did you bring the flying Pokemon? Lusaman's eyes lit up. Need not. Yibei shook his head. I can fly. Lusaman's beautiful face showed a strong grudge once again. Don't have a charming white eye Yibei. It's all this time. Why are you still making such jokes? I'm not joking with you. Remember to hold me tight later. Otherwise I don't care if I fall. Yi Bei I winked with a smirk from the blonde lady in front of her. What? What does Yi Bei I mean despite not ending? But out of trust in Yi Bei I's character, Lusaman still hugged Yi Bei I's waist subconsciously, sticking her whole body to Yi Bei I's body. Next moment, the energy behind Yi Bei I is fanned by dual wing beat. The figures of the two jumped into the sky in an instant, chasing after the two legendary Pokémon far away from here. Ah, a high-pitched and loud scream came out of Lusamin's mouth and went straight into the sky. Dot. Chapter 82 Raiders Lusamin Yi Bei I, it doesn't matter, I will make a move. The picture keeps flashing before my eyes. With the moonlight sprinkled on Lunala, Lusamin overlooked the earth from a high altitude, her eyes widened in disbelief, with all the strength in his body. He hugged Yi Bei I tightly. Are you dot 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 really human? Of course. It's guaranteed to be true. Seeing that Lu Samin, who had been reluctant to believe herself, was finally convinced by the facts in front of her, Yi Bei I, who had already flown 10,000 meters above the sky, showed a smile. Immediately, he opened Lu Samin's arms that encircled him, let its sky drop. The wind keeps passing by Lu Samin. Lu Samin, who was weightless, fell straight to the ground below. The strong wind made Lu Samin unable to open his eyes, and the pictures kept flashing in front of his eyes. The distance to ground is getting closer and closer. Ah, Lusamin kept exclaiming, her adrenaline soared, her heartbeat soared to an extremely exaggerated level, just when Lusamin thought she was about to die, suddenly, she felt a warm embrace hugging herself, and blocked the blowing wind for himself, at the same time, her body is no longer a weightless contest condition, falling straight down, last come first come, after catching up with Lusamin, Yibei I used his body to block Lusamin's front, draw a U-shaped arc in the air facing each other, and fly back into the air, period. Affected by gravity, Lusaman almost melted into Yi Bei I's body. Half an hour, do not feel body drop. The surrounding wind is no longer violent, but becomes gentle. In addition, the waist was embraced. Lusaman finally braved O3 to open his eyes. As soon as I caught my eyes, I saw Yi Bei I's handsome face revealing a bit of hate, which was close to him, facing each other. Arsal, Lusaman, 
with tears streaming from the corners of her eyes, raised her powder fist and hit Yi Bei I continuously. You almost scared me to death just now, sorry, looking at Lu Suman who was so sad that she was crying in front of her. Yi Bei I felt deeply sorry for his tricky idea. I blame myself very much, eyes facing each other, feel the sincere apology in Yi Bei I's eyes, Lu Suman softened immediately. After all, Yi Bei I is just a boy not much older than Bladian. Be naughty, that's normal. What's more, this is indeed a very exciting and beautiful memory. Don't do this next time, I forgive you. Stretching out a hand to gently caress Yi Bei I's handsome face palms in contact with Yi Bei's face. With hindsight, I feel that the action is a bit too ambiguous. Lu Suman was stunned for a moment. She didn't just pull her hand, and it certainly wouldn't work if she continued to hold it. And, she could feel her body jumping for joy. Nihiligo's previous possession is still affecting her. Lu Suman didn't withdraw her hand for a long time. The scene was very warm at one point. Next time, as an atmosphere terminator, Yi Bei easily destroyed Lu Suman's dilemma, while giving the other party a step down but it won't make the atmosphere more awkward. But such a mature performance, but hit the right way, it struck at the root of Lu Simon's worries. Yi Bei was not mature enough. For a while, Yi Bei's image became more and more perfect in Lu Simon's heart. And perfect things, it is the existence that Lu Simon is almost determined to win now. Under Yi Bei's astonishment, Lu Simon wraps her arms around the back of Yi Bei's head, hooking Yi Bei slightly. The body leans forward, the toes are raised in the void, a fragrant wind blows. Well, Yi Bei's eyes widened in disbelief, Mom, you, under the moonlight, time seems to be suspended, after about ten minutes. The movement made by the two divine beasts facing Bo broke the charming atmosphere just now. When Yi Bei wants to go further, but he saw the astonishment and regret in Lu Simon's emerald eyes, realizing that Lu Simon is not voluntary, although somewhat uncomfortable and depressed, but Yi Bei still controls the biological position, only covering Lu Simon, flying at high speed. Dispel restlessness with Horatio. Came to a flat rock plateau. Yi Bei I put Lu Simon on the ground. Sorry. No, it's not your fault. It's me who should say sorry. As if her strength had been drained, Lu Simon, who was leaning on Yi Bei I, looked down and apologized with a blushing face. Since being possessed by Nihiligo, I seem to have an almost crazy covet for beautiful things. And you, in my eyes, are almost perfect except immature. But just now your mature side showed. Make your image more and more perfect. So what just happened? Although it makes sense. But Lu Simon made a mistake after all, and she couldn't forgive herself. Moreover, how could others believe such a thing? Yi Bei I would definitely regard her as a bad woman. In addition, she made a mistake. How will she face Gladian and Lily in the future? So it is. Yi Bei I looked dazed. But it was beyond Lu Simon's expectation, and he believed Lu Simon's statement directly. Question mark. Certainly, although the more beautiful a woman is, the more deceiving she is, but I believe eyes can't deceive you. Thanks. While hearing Yi Bei I enlightening himself, but she didn't forget to praise herself for being beautiful. Lushor felt a burst of warmth and restlessness. Damn. The effects of Nihiligo's possession reappeared. Lu Simon frowned. It's just that, unlike the previous few times, although I felt my heart beat this time, I didn't take any action. Is this really influenced by Nihiligo? Lu Simon pursed her mind and asked herself, falling into a wordless silence. Yi Bei is excellent. It seemed that she was getting deeper and deeper on the road of making mistakes. Is it going to sink deeper and deeper? Have Yi Bei I provide the fatherly love Gladian and Luli are missing? A crazy idea flooded into Lu Simon's mind. Just quickly, Lu Simon shook her head in panic. Get that scary thought out of your head. No, I have to get down to business. Realizing that he couldn't continue to think wildly, Lu Simon looked at the two sides fighting in the air. The line of sight falls on the back of the head of the Pokemon codenamed Jube, pitch black, looking at the Lucas mark carved on the opponent's head. Lu Simon showed astonishment. Could it be that Jube? Darkness has something to do with Lucas? Lu Simon whispered. He is the great god Lucas. Suddenly, an aged voice entered the minds of Yi Bei and Lu Simon. Who? The two turned their heads together and saw a large group of bee-like Pokemon flying in the distance. Naganadel. There are so many. Looking at the densely packed Naganadel, as if covering the whole soaring in the sky, Lu Simon subconsciously grabbed Yi Bei's arm nervously. Humans from another world. Please take it easy. We will not attack you. Naganadel promises to arrive. Gently patted Lu Simon's nervous little hand. Yi Bei raised his head and looked at the oldest Naganadel. Actually, I'm not nervous. Well, it can be seen that you are very confident. Unexpectedly, just looking at each other, Naganadel believed Yi Bei's words. Sorry to bother you. Excuse me, the Lucas god you are talking about, is it you? Pitch black? Lu Simon poked her head out from behind Yi Bei with a curious look on her face. Her heart is unbelievable, you, whose body is so dark that it has almost nothing to do with the light. It's so dark. It's actually Lucas. Yes, the old Naganadel narrated how Necrozma lost his power. 507. Dot 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 so, Necrozma is just getting back the power he once had? But Lunala wants Necrozma to wait a little longer and find another way to achieve coexistence. 
help Necrozma regain power? That's it, huh? We will choose to sacrifice ourselves to buy time for Lord Moon God to escape. You also take the opportunity to leave as soon as possible. If you can, please also ask your companions to work together to help the Moon God and the Sun God, save our world. The old and tragic voice fell at the same time. The battle in the air is coming to an end. Necrozma suppressed Lunala, and was about to devour and fuse him. The situation has reached a point of urgency. Okay, I will ask my people to send you out of here, and leave this place to us. The old Naganadel commanded a male and a female, and the two weak Naganadels, come to Yibei and Lusamin respectively. Lusamin, who understands the general, understands, staying by yourself will only hinder you, and you will immediately step onto the back of the female Naganadel. The old Naganadel is also ready to dedicate his life to the moon god with his tribe. Yibei called out to the Naganadels who were about to launch a death charge. You never thought. Why am I not afraid of you, not even Necrozma and Lunala? Human you? Could it be? Aged Naganadel looked startled, Lusamin next to him was also very curious. The corners of Yibei eyes mouth rose slightly. Turn your palm upwards, and a Master Ball appears in your hand. The moment I saw the shape of Master Ball, the sense of anticipation and thirst for knowledge in Lusamin's heart reached its peak in an instant. Come on, Rayquaza, Red Bloom, a 70 meter long behemoth appeared in soaring in the sky. The breath of law and authority instantly attracted the police from Chukaresma and Lunala. Chapter 83 Lily, Yibei is hugging my mother! Exclamation mark. Strong law breath, with black Rayquaza's domineering sideways shape, instantly attracted the attention of Necrozma and Lunala during the battle. Question mark Necrozma psychic question mark ability, prism armor, when receiving an attack with excellent effects, its power can be weakened. Question mark talent, KI question mark level, 145 question mark Lunala. Psychic plus ghost question mark ability phantom defense question mark talent ki question mark level 140 compared to Rayquaza at level 155 both Pokemon are much lower in level that's why the main reason why Yibei I was not worried about encountering too much danger at first Dragon Rush covered in a stance of Chenwood energy Black Rayquaza charged straight at Necrozma not giving Necrozma any room to react at all. Black Rayquaza hit Necrozma directly into soaring in the sky with a powerful blow. Mahina. Lunala looked suspiciously at Black Rayquaza who was taking over from him. Tilted his head. Lunala was full of puzzlement. How come Black Rayquaza has never been encountered in this world before? But, although Lunala, currently in opposition to Necrozma, but unwilling to stand idly by, let Rayquaza attack Necrozma. No matter what, Necrozma is also in a sense herself. Luna 657 Yara is ready to help and then find a way to escape. She burst into light all over and sent a long-range attack to Rayquaza, in the face of incoming attacks. Rayquaza, who holds the authority of soaring in the sky, easily discovered it in advance, while Black Rayquaza first used extreme speed to repel Necrozma, turning around, spit out a fiery dragon pulse energy from the mouth, neutralizes Lunala's attack. Yibei I witnessed the whole process, knowing I had to act, he wants to remind Lunala that he wants to help her, only, after all, Lunala is a super legendary Pokemon, in case of shooting him, it is very likely to endanger Yibei's life, before making a move, Yibei summoned the Genesect, the reason why it is not the stronger Groudon is because Groudon is betraying the water, before fully confirming that Groudon recognized him, it was impossible for Yibei to send the other party out at this critical moment, behind the energy dual wing beat fanning, Yibei flew to Lusamin, sorry, Necrozma and Lunala are super type legendary Pokemon, for your safety, madame, Please stay as close to me as possible for now. Stretching out his right hand, Yibei firmly grabbed Lusamin's waist without leaving Lusamin room to think. Well, the momentary touch, Advk, and Yibei's overbearing made Lusamin tremble. Shame on Lusamin. She actually has feelings for Yibei, with a flushed face. She simply pretended to be afraid of heights and buried her head in Yibei's embrace. At the same time, Yibei quickly flew to Genesect, let Genesect envelop himself and Lusamin with a biological force field and fully activate the power of law authority. Under double insurance, Yibei I just made a sound. Lunala, stop trying to attack, Rayquaza is here to help you. Mahina. Lunala looked back in doubt. His eyes fell on Yibei, his eyes full of curiosity and exploration. At this time, Naganadel flew into the air, take the initiative to solve the doubts in Lunala's heart. Under the explanation of old Naganadel, on Lunala's face, there was a touch of human gratitude. Also dropped the idea of Attacking Rayquaza. Cool. After confirming that Lunala is very intelligent and has a relatively docile personality, Yibei I breathed a sigh of relief. Lunala, just need to provide enough energy for Necrozma. I can help you and Solgaleo, right? Mahina. Lunala nodded excitedly. This is the best way for her and Solgaleo to avoid being swallowed. Then, 
Can you help me open the passage to the Pokemon world? I'll let the humans and Pokemon over the work together to help you complete the charge. Although ye bay I can return to the Pokemon world with Lucem and through the underground world, but in this way, but it can only do back and forth, cannot be used to charge the Necrozma. To complete its charging, it needs to be like in the chapter of the Sun and Moon, gather the power of Superhuman and Pokemon to charge Necrozma, just like in the finale of Ultimate Tiga the people who give brilliance the trust and support of all mankind for Tiga. Although Necrozma does not need so much power of all mankind, but at least the support of the entire Alola region is needed. Mahina. Disappointed by Yubei, Lunala shook her head. She couldn't sense where the Pokemon world was. At the same time, Pokemon world, although Yubei promised to rescue their mother, but Lily and Gladian did not give up on rescuing their mother. Under the help of two professors, Barnet and Kukui, found a way to enter the ultimate world. Gather a large amount of energy to help the evolution of the small nebula. Then let the little nebula who has gained power open the passage to the ultimate world. Alola region, altar of the sun, Lily, Gladian and Nebula, all four island gods gather here. Little Xinyan, it's up to you to save my mother. Already on the way, the small nebula that evolved from Cosmog into Momu nodded earnestly. Then, please everyone. Lily looked at the four island patron saints for help. Wu, the four patron saints of the island, each occupying a position. Sent energy towards Cosmomu in the center of the altar. Gladian and Silverly use Z skills to charge Cosmomu at the same time. In the dazzling light, Cosmomu's body gradually expands. Finally, in the dazzling light of evolution, he turned into a lion with fluffy brown hair. He has mainly white skin, blue gray nose, and light blue eyes, strong limbs, and tail. It is Solgaleo. After successfully evolving, Solgaleo behaved very close to Lily. At the same time, with the appearance of Solgaleo, Lunala finally sensed the coordinates of the Pokemon world. Mahina. Suddenly, Lunala flaps her wings. An invisible wave of confusion is sent towards the void ahead. Seeing this, Yibei quickly informed Rayquaza that he was going to return to the Pokemon world, and leave Necrozma alone here first. When everything is ready, come back to deal with Necrozma losing his mind. World of Pokemon, Solgaleo sensed that Lunala was building a channel, also gathered an energy channel in the air. With the joint efforts of both parties, an energy channel connecting the two worlds was quickly constructed. Solgaleo fell from the sky and came in front of Lily and Gladian. Big brother, let's go. After experiencing the baptism of this incident, Lily put on a single ponytail, and her temperament has obviously become much more mature. She wants to pick up her mother herself. Only, when such a thought just arises, the picture that caught her eyes completely petrified her. What did she see? Lunala took the lead in drilling the ultra wormhole. Immediately afterwards, Yibei and Black Rayquaza also came out. Meanwhile, her Lord Mother, Miss Lusamin, shamelessly lying in Yi Bei's arms. Lily, Bei Moonlight is with my mother. What should I do? Wait online. Urgent. Chapter 84 I, Groudon, can do it again. The ultimate Necrozma. Black Rayquaza flew out of the tunnel, and the Ultra Wormhole closed. Necrozma, like Yi Bei's original plan, was trapped in the ultimate world. But the good times don't last long. Lunala can feel Solgaleo's breath, and thus determine the direction of the Pokemon world. Necrozma can feel the breath of both at the same time. A new Ultra Wormhole will appear soon. The dark figure of Necrozma appeared in the sky of Alola Sea. Almost at the moment Necrozma appeared, Necrozma automatically absorbed the energy of Lucas that was scattered in the Alola region back then. Lucas, the sun soaring in the sky, is also gradually dissipating, and the entire Alola region begins to fall into darkness. The happy, happy, positive, and optimistic contest condition of the local residents of Alola began to dissipate, becoming sleepy, lazy, and negative. What happened? Feel abnormalities in the body. Island Kahuna, with a firm will, barely overcomes laziness. Climbing out of the comfortable wooden house with strong support, get down on the ground and look up at Necrozma soaring in the sky. What is happening? Looking down on the earth from above, seeing that the residents of Alolo are all exhausted, Lusaman looked puzzled. Just thinking like this, the mobile phone on Lusaman's waist suddenly rang. Professor Burnett, come into view. She was a dark skinned, weak looking young woman with weak temperament. Thank goodness, Director Lusamin, you're all right. Oh, that's great. Strangely enough, Barnett's voice was broken and weak. Even, even seeing Chairman Lusamin lying on a man's chest, such great news. None of them could make Barnett work hard and arouse the desire to gossip. Professor Burnett, you too? Why is everyone in Alola so lethargic? You're not in the mood, are you? I glanced at the gradually dim soaring in the sky outside the window. Professor Burnett braced his sleepy consciousness and came to a row of ancient books. I probably understand the seriousness of the matter, wait a minute, let me read the ancient books first. Hang up the phone. Professor Burnett searched the relevant records. At the same time, under the protection of the sun god Solgaleo, Lily and Gladian, who were not affected, it's too late to care about their mother, who is lying in the arms of a young man, like the excessive behavior of a little girl in love. Lily leads Solgaleo and Gladian leads Silverly to join the battle group. 
beat up Necrozma. Necrozma opened to all, absorb it all. The supplement of energy made him almost lose his mind, finally felt the long lost comfort. Even, Necrozma exploded with stronger power and speed, to devour Solgaleo and Lunala, but, there are Yibei and Black Rayquaza, and the four guardian spirits of the island exist. Necrozma failed to do so. Knowing the energy attack will make up for the lack of energy in Necrozma's body and resolve the conflict, Yibei summoned all the Pokemon under his command to help Necrozma recover the lost energy. Necrozma, please do not devour Solgaleo and Lunala, Rayquaza and I, as well as the residents of the entire Alola region, will give you the ability to help you restore your original appearance. Yibei's voice outlet, instantly attracted the attention of Necrozma. Solgaleo and Lunala, the difference is that, when seeing Mega Black Rayquaza, Necrozma's ferocious eyes showed a little clarity, on the face of normal, the Lion of Solgaleo, there was a bit of doubt, as for Lunala, she is purely happy, Yibei really did what he said, and he was really helping them get rid of the faith of being swallowed, Lunala shook her wings excitedly, flew to Yibei and Black Rayquaza and circled round, at the same time, Professor Burnett has also found records related to the current situation, legendary in ancient times, the great god Lucas spread his light to every corner of Alola, which made the residents of Alola begin to become happy, happy and optimistic. But the great god Lucas lost his power because of this, and fell into a long sleep. Could it be? Lube, darkness is Lucas after losing his light, he is taking back everything that belongs to him? I have some guesses in my mind. Professor Burnett summarized all ideas to Lusamin and Professor QQE. Stop guessing. Necrozma is what you call Lube, pitch black which is also the great god Lucas in the records, at, it suddenly stuck next to Lusaman and appeared in the camera, this sudden change, let Barnet and QQE look at each other in dismay, let Lily, who was kneeling on Solgaleo's back in the distance, gritted her teeth, at the same time, Yibea paused for the coming body fragrance, subconsciously took a deep breath, and while Lusaman's face became more rosy, he continued, god Lucas now needs enough energy to restore his former appearance, which is related to the lives of Solgaleo and Lunala, so please everyone, broadcast this incident to the residents of the entire Alola region, and let them contribute their energy to God Lucas. I see, emergency, too late to care about gossip, QQE and his beloved wife, Professor Burnett, looked at each other, zero dot ask for flowers, all people radio is turned on, while Professor QQE mobilized all the residents of Alola, Yibei summons all of his Pokemon, command them to unleash long range strikes that channel power to the Necrozma, the huge body of primal ground suddenly appeared in the shallows of a certain coast, the huge size gives people a sense of suffocation, the astonishing heat in the environment made the tourists lying on the beach feel the threat of death one by one, strongly propped up his body and fled to the distance, at the same time, with the appearance of primal ground, the soaring in the sky, which had already fallen into darkness, cleared up again, the frequent alternation of day and night, let the residents of Alola feel that the end of the world is coming, Groudon, attack with Rayquaza, Yibei's voice came into Groudon's mind, looking up, crowd and saw four huge figures on soaring in the sky, oh oh, the moment I saw Mega Black Rayquaza, Primal Groudon, who has initially fused the Zoroid Orb, is very swollen inside, can't wait to target Black Rayquaza, a beam of destructive death spit up from the mouth, exuding an astonishingly high temperature laser, and aimed straight at Rayquaza, you boy, all right, originally, Yibea planned to help Groudon change the teaching attribute, let him experience the feeling of flying, now, slap, soon, this treatment is gone, Stop Mega Black Rayquaza from wanting revenge back. Yibei directed Black Rayquaza to fly behind Necrozma. Primal Groudon wanted to attack Rayquaza, so he could only defeat Necrozma who was standing in front. And Groudon did get hooked. HMPH, Caterpie, you have today too. You, Mr. Groudon, are going to get back in the game hard today. Primal Groudon spit out as if he didn't want money for destruction, death light, and Necrozma launched a full absorption, energy recovery, and the level rose rapidly. Yibei also commanded Black Rayquaza to start outputting. Genesect, Yibei's Pokemon, the four island guardians, Solgaleo, Lunala, all began to send energy to Necrozma. Under the mobilization of Professor Kukui, the public took action one after another. Under the guidance of Island Kahuna and the Queen of the Island, he dedicated his power to the great god Lucas. Gold beams of light, soaring up from every living being, it converges toward Necrozma. Above soaring in the sky, the dazzling golden light completely enveloped Necrozma's body, and in the center of the light, Necrozma Black's body gradually began to emit girl, the hands changed into two feet, the four wings on the back swung, and a tail grew out. Ultimate Necrozma, Superpowered Plus Dragon, 8, Chapter 85 Lusamin, Yibei, I, I have decided to start a new life. Question mark Ultimate Necrozma Super Plus Dragon, Question mark Ability, Brain Core Power, Question mark Talent, Ki, Question mark Level, 300, Question mark Height, 240M, Level 300, Looking at the sky, 
The huge figure of Lucas exudes eye-catching. Yi Bei I opened his mouth wide in surprise. It was the first time he saw such a high-level Pokémon. It is indeed a low-profile version of the creator of the world. Recovering the lost power, the ultimate Necrozmas glanced at Solgaleo and Lunala. This time, his eyes no longer showed the desire to devour. It is full of divinity looking down. Skimming both, Necrozmas gaze swept across the entire Alola region that gave him energy. Shining brightly, endless Lucas enveloped the whole area of Alola, people's sleepiness exhaustion, and negativity disappeared completely, rejuvenated, all minor ailments in the body are eradicated. The patients in the ward also regained their health under the treatment of this light. Paralyzed patients, under the self-healing of this light, their limbs regained consciousness. The whole of Alola ushered in a carnival. Do what you can, ultimate Necrozma finally looked at Yibei. He is very grateful to Yibei for everything he has done for 163. Looking at each other, Ultra Necrozma nodded, and summoned Ultra Wormhole, Body Flash, and returned to the ultimate world. After the Ultra Necrozma enters, the Ultra Wormhole begins to shrink. And Lily, who is concerned about her father's whereabouts, immediately asks Solgaleo to pursue the ultimate world. Lily, Lucerman's eyes widened in astonishment, anxiously wanting to call out to her daughter. Similarly, Gladian, who is Lily's big brother, is also a very nervous sister. Lily, Gladian looked back at Lucerman who was standing next to Yubei, gritted his teeth and they made a decision. Let's go, Silverly. Gladian commanded Silverly to catch up and the moment Silverly entered the channel, channel closed, soaring in the sky back to normal, Gladio. Witnessing two children entering the ultra wormhole one after another, Lucerman's eyes went dark, her body went limp, and she lost all strength. About to fall, Yibei quickly stretched out his arms to wrap around Lucerman's waist, a fragrant wind blows, Lucerman was unable to rely on Yibei's body, actually, we can still go there. Yibei patted Lucerman's fragrant shoulders showing her fair and delicate clavicle, and comforted her. Really? Lucerman's hopeful eyes fell on Yibei. At this time, Mahina, Lunala flew in front of the two of them. By the way, Lunala, you haven't left yet. Lucerman said in surprise. Yibei, in fact, what he wants to say is that he has long left a secret base in the ultimate world. However, Lunala is more convenient. Lunala, how did you become like this? Looking at Lunala, which is only about two meters in front of me, and only a thin layer from the side, Yibei was full of doubts. What Yibei didn't expect was that, Mega Black Rayquaza was actually in front of his eyes, shrinking visible to the naked eye. Soon, the body of 140 meters has shrunk down to 14 meters, 10 times more than that. Yibei and Lusaman also changed from standing on the head of Mega Rayquaza to Yibei riding Rayquaza, holding Lusaman around his waist. Period. The world in front of Yibei is completely blocked by two touches of seductive white, with Mega Rayquaza's biological stance removed too much, exposing Yibei to the air. When the gust of wind blows at an altitude of 10,000 meters, Lucerman's whole body is crushed down. That long golden hair surrounded Yibei even more. Almost suffocated to death by Yibei, directly achieved the global limited edition gold mummy. Still twins. Unleash the power of authority. A breeze blew from behind, blowing away gold's hair that was entangled with her, and Yibei helped Lucerman. Looking again at the shrunken Rayquaza, Yibei was amazed. Unexpectedly, the beast can actively control the size of the body which is really insightful. After some emotion, Yibei collects all Pokémon except Rayquaza, of course also including Primal Groudon below. Although Groudon tried his best to resist, it was useless at all. After Yibei linked Ultra Ball to Flying Secret Realm, unless Groudon can break through the Flying Rift, otherwise, he wouldn't be able to get out at all. In order to prevent other Pokémon from being murdered by Groudon, Yibei, who has no time to teach him, cut off the link between other Pokémon Pokéball and Sky Rift. Done these. Lusamin finally had time to interject. Yibei, can you put me down? You hug me from behind, or dot 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 r. I haven't finished talking yet. Lusamin's smooth underarms on both sides were erected by Yibei, and the whole person was lifted, hanging in the air at a height of 10,000 meters. Lusamin was almost not scared to death by Yibei. Fortunately, Yibei's hands were very strong and did not tremble at all. This gave Lusamin a little confidence and a sense of security. Soon, Lusamin was turned around by Yibei appeared in front of Yibei. The two are like riding a motorcycle, one behind the other, Yibei did not forget to extend his arms around Lusaman intimately to give support. After sitting still, the waist was embraced by Yibei's firm and reliable arms again. Lusaman was relieved for a while, shortness of breath, turning his head, shamelessly stretched out his small powder fist to hit Yibei's chest. I haven't finished my sentence yet. Yibei, you really owe me a beating. Lusaman didn't realize it himself. When getting along with Yibei, she always has a quick heartbeat and maintains a young heart. Vent the grudge accumulated in my heart from astonish. At this moment, Lucerman found a new problem, that is, she was in the front, which seemed a bit unsightly. And over time, it will not even be just a matter of unsightly, 
Just don't wait for her to speak, go behind you bay Lunala opened the ultra wormhole, Black Rayquaza rushed into it with an acceleration, Lu Summon had to shut up, at the same time, Ultimate World, with a return of the ultimate necrosma of a zenith contest condition, the ultimate world, which was originally bleak and almost on the verge of collapse, regained girl, creation authority restored, under the influence of ultimate necrosma, the ecology of the ultimate world began to recover, grasslands, forests, lakes, rivers, seas, has been sown in life, until the ultimate world is completely restored to life, all that remains is to wait. God Lucas, I want to ask you something. Solgaleo head. Lily closed her eyes and blocked the glare from the A's with her hands. He held his head up and spoke the words that had been hidden in his heart for a long time, above the sky. Ultimate Necrozma seems to be in a good mood. Make an act of listening. I wonder if my father had. Her father has been gone for many years. At that time, I was doing research on Ultra Wormhole. Therefore, the guess of their family is that the other party came to the Ultimate World Zero for this guess. Ultimate Necrozma Psychic launches, sweeping every corner of the Ultimate World. It is a pity. He didn't feel any existence related to Lily's breath in the ultimate world. In this world, there is no aura related to you. This answer, it also fell into the ears of Gladian, Lusamin. The three of them all showed disappointment for a while. Gladian and Lusamin are okay. They are very mature, knowing that a living person has been missing for so many years. It is difficult to have good news. It's just that the simpler Lily is different. The petite body seemed to be emptied of all strength, almost falling from the top of Solio's head. Alas, my condolences. Looking at Lusamin, who is close at hand. In grief, Yibei I comforted him. Thanks, can I borrow your shoulder? Sure. Yibei I opened his arms, and Lusamin threw herself into Yibei I's arms. Tears flow out, body trembles constantly. The sob hero weeps. Yibei I patted Lusamin's shoulder tenderly. At the same time, let Lunala pick up Lily. Yibei I's original intention was to let Lily hug Lusamin, and the mother and daughter would have a good talk. As a result, when Lily came over, she also threw herself into his arms. Fortunately, he does not lack this strength and he can bear the weight of the two women. Just when Yi Bei I raised his head, Gladian just came riding silverly, seeing this scene, the corner of Yi Bei I's mouth twitched, why don't you come over and let me hug you? Yi Bei I sent an invitation to Gladian, these words instantly dispelled Gladian's vigilance. But it also aroused Gladian's self-esteem to be stronger, the little boy folded his hands on his chest and forced back the tears from the corners of his eyes. After a long time, Lusamin finally stopped crying at 2.4. He gently reached out and wiped the corners of Lily's eyes that were red from crying. Actually, I have been prepared for this answer since a long time ago. Now, Lily, Gladian, maybe it's time for us to start over. From now on, there is no need to look for the whereabouts of your father anymore. I will no longer only be obsessed with work, but will pay attention to your basic necessities of life. Brothers and sisters, be prepared. Then don't think I'm nagging again. Huh, no way. Lily made a somewhat angry voice and said arrogantly, I don't need it, just follow Lily. Gladian turned his head away. This one is even more arrogant. Then, we're heading home. Yi Bei I interrupted the warm conversation of the family of three, command Black Rayquaza to quickly pass through the Ultra Wormhole and return to Alola. In the blink of an eye, in the ultimate world, that leaves only Necrozma, Solgaleo, Lunala, Gladian and Silverly. Hey, wait for me. Seeing that the Ultra Wormhole is about to close, Gladian and Silverly hurriedly followed. Downsized Solgaleo and Lunala are not far behind. Not long after, only Necrozma remained in the soaring in the sky of the entire ultimate world. Dot. Chapter 86, Kapu Ming Ming Gives Gifts. Lusaman's initiative. Before Yi Bei and others returned to Alola region, a yellow lightning flashed, entered the home of Island Kahuna Hall, take a Z crystal and a Z ring. Ariel, Yi Bei and his group finally returned to Alola region, now that I have decided to start over. Then some ideas appeared in Lusaman's mind. In Lusaman's eyes, Yi Bei is a good development target. When being with Yi Bei, Lusamin can always feel the throbbing of youth. Subconsciously, Lusamin raised her slender hands and straightened her neckline. Make sure to lean back slightly, that would give Yi Bei some incredible views. At the same time, she is always paying attention to the movements of her daughter Luli in front of her. I know that my daughter is very sensitive now, she does not intend to show her pursuit of Yi Bei on the bright side. These moves, under the cover of mature Lusamin, it looks very natural. Even Yi Bei sitting behind have never been found. He still wants to send Lusamin mother and daughter back to Ether Paradise. As a result, he encountered Tapu Wu's interception head-on. Wu Black Rayquaza opened his mouth, ready to attack. Terrified, Tapu Koko hastily put the shells on both sides of his body together and dodged in the distance. Wait, Rayquaza. Under Tapu's tense defense, Yi Bei called out Black Rayquaza. The attack did not come for a long time. Tapu Koko was relieved, reopened the closed shells, flew back to Yi Bei and Black Rayquaza. This time, he chose to appear beside Black Rayquaza, 
Make your own body side by side with Yubei, spreading his paws. Tepukoko threw to Yubei a small diamond-shaped object and a pair of bracelets. Yubei took a look and found that it was Zed Crystal and the matching Zed Ring. Zed Crystal is an ore unique to the Alola region. It contains the power of the four island patron saints, which are closely related to their law and authority. Wear the Zed Ring inlaid with Zed Pure Crystals, and cooperate with Pokemon to perform specific actions. You can release the Zed skill that is far more powerful than the normal moves. Like before, the Gigavolt Havoc used by Annabelle. At the moment, what Tapu gave to Yibei I was also an electric pure crystal. Woo, chirp. Kapu Ming Ming took the lead and flew towards the Meli Mel Island below. Tapu Koko is looking for Yibei. What will happen? Lily looked curious. Tapu Koko is the patron saint of the island. It is rare to show up in front of trainer, but when Lily saw Black Rayquaza below her, she fell silent for a while. It seems that Yibei is not the trainer of common. Watching the crying daughter's red eyes shift her focus. The corners of Lusaman's mouth raised slightly, turning his head, his long eyelashes blinked, and his jewel-like pupils looked at Yibei expectantly and asking for help. Long life. Lusaman is actually charging him with charm. Follow up and have a look. As a good young man who loves the beauty of adults, Yibei immediately decided to satisfy the curiosity of Lily and Lusaman's mother and daughter. Black Rayquaza quickly changed to keep up with Kapawu. Behind them, Gladion and Silverly, who just got out of Ultra Wormhole, seeing this, Solgaleo and Lunala hurriedly followed curiously. The process close to the ground, Yibei also found that in the square, a large number of residents are gathering together, seems to be throwing a Courtney party. Looking at those special delicacies that are rarely seen, you can smell the fragrance from there when flying and soaring in the sky. Yibei licked his lips, decided, when the matter on Tapu's side is resolved, we must have a meal. Exactly. Lu Summon turned around and saw Yi Bei licking his lips. A flash of embarrassment instantly flashed across the delicate and fair pretty face. A little joy flashed in my heart. Unexpectedly, her attraction to Yi Bei is so great, looking down at the neckline which was only opened a little bit. According to most people's thinking, this kind of dress can actually be regarded as conservative. But Yi Bei's performance is so exaggerated, it seems that taking Yi Bei is really promising. Just as Lu Summon fell into fantasy time, they have arrived at their destination which is an empty battlefield. Tapu whimpered to the other side of the battlefield, pointing to the pure crystal in Yubei's hand, then pointing to himself. You want me to fight against you? Yubei showed astonishment. Wu Tapu nodded, but accepted Yubei's guess. J. Yubei showed embarrassment. I don't have an electric type Pokemon. After a pause, Yubei continued. Although I have a Pokemon that can use electric skills, that shouldn't be the battle you want, right? Wu Tapu nodded slightly disappointed. Fail to fight? Not only let Tapu feel disappointed, even Lily, Lusamin and Gladian feel a little pity. By the way, can Tapu Koko play against me? Gladian jumped excitedly off Silverly's back. Silverly also showed a strong fighting spirit, but Tapu Koko flew away directly. Dot. Facing me, don't you even have the desire to fight? Gladian lowered his head in disappointment and clenched his head tightly. At this time, a pair of warm hands covered Gladian's head. A gentle voice came from Lu Summon's mouth. I think Tapu probably thinks that you still need to go through more trials. Mother? Gladian raised his head in astonishment. In the past, shouldn't Lu Summon choose to ignore such situations? This is unreasonable. While feeling unbelievable in my heart, Gladio had a smile on his face. Apostrophe question mark I see, mother. I will continue to work hard to become stronger. The other side. Yi Bei watched Tapu's humming figure gradually go away, reminiscent of the electric type Edmunds distributed in the Alola region. The electric cat Gilola, Yi Bei murmured softly. Wait a little longer, after a while. I will finish this battle with you, Wu Tilda. As if hearing Yi Bei's whisper, Tapu's humming sound spread throughout the soaring in the sky, and the appearance of this voice, in the eyes of the people who are preparing for Courtney in the distance, it becomes the blessing of the island patron saint to them. More smiles bloomed on each face. It looks like a Courtney party is going to be held over there. Shall we go and have a look? Yi Bei stretched out his finger and pointed, and saw the direction where the crowd gathered just now. Courtney party. Lusamin put her left hand across her chest put her right hand on top of her left hand, and pressed her fist against her white and clean chin, on King Ching's face, the jewel-like pupils reveal a thoughtful look, can you, mother, thinking that if I go to the Courtney party, I can interact with my mother, Lily, who has never felt a harmonious family atmosphere since she was a child, is looking forward to it, clenches both hands in front of the chest, get Kian Zhao, Lily looked down, but her eyes were looking up, usually at this time, Lu Summon usually shirks because he is busy with work, will it really change, gazing at Lu Summon, Gladian showed anticipation on his face. Witnessing her daughter Lily's cautious appearance, and Gladian's expectant A's, Lusamin felt a pang of heartache. How derelict my past self was. Shaking his head, a smile appeared on Lusamin's coin my face, and her delicate red lips were slightly raised. 
Sure, I was just wondering if I should call Professor Burnett and the others over to the Courtney party. Yes, of course. After hearing that Lucimin agreed to attend Courtney's party, Lily jumped up and down with excitement. X7. The girl's cheers fell into Lucimin's eyes, but it made her feel even more guilty. So, she's woken up, and out of the corner of the eye fell on eBay eye, Lucimin smiled. Looks like she came to her senses just in time. Everything is just right just like the arrangement of fate. Chapter 87 Subdue Lunella. Invite Lusamin to dance. Master? Lily's eyes fell on Lusamin, seeing Ye Bei Ai following Lusamin's line of sight. Lily's heart shuddered. Finally, he recalled the scene he had seen before. What's wrong? Looking back, Lusamin's beautiful face smiled at her daughter. It's okay, let's go. Take Lusamin's hand, Lily sprinted toward hosting Courtney's party. Soon, then he pulled Ye Bei Ai and Gladian far away. Come on, keep working hard and sooner or later you will be recognized by Tapukoko with Silverly. Coming to Gladian's side, Yibei reached out and patted Gladian's shoulder. Thanks, I think that's what's bound to happen. Yibei does not deny that the Gladian brothers and sisters are really polite, but it does not deny that Gladian is very stinky. What are you two going to do? Turn around and put away Black Rayquaza? Yibei looked at Solgaleo and Lunala floating in the air with an inquiring gaze. Mahina. Lunala walked around Yibei and finally pointed to the poke ball on Yibei's waist. You want to be my partner and travel with me? Yibei showed astonishment. Gladian's jaw almost dropped from shock. What is this unfolding? Mahina. Lunala narrowed her eyes and nodded quickly, confirming the fact. Then it's up to you, Lunala. Yibei took out a brand new ultra ball and threw it at Lunala. Clack. The ultra ball crashes into Lunala's starry patterned wings, opens quickly, shoots a red light, envelops Lunala and absorbs it. Thump. Ultra ball successfully subdued Lunala without any shaking. 410. Ooh. Actually subdued it? Gladian looked as if he had seen a ghost. With a face full of envy, obviously Yi Bei I already owns Black Rayquaza and Primal Groudon, but he didn't even tame a single divine beast. Now Yi Bei I even subdued the third beast. If Yi Bei I knows Gladian's thoughts, will definitely be corrected. Exclamation mark. Counting Genesect, this is the fourth beast that Yi Bei I tamed. Secondly, although Silverly is a man-made Pokemon, it can also be classified as a mythical beast. Strictly speaking. It is not that Gladian has not subdued all the beasts. Come out, Lunala. After finishing the collection, Yibei released Lunala. Lunala can fly, and when you meet a crowded place, you can fly to the sky to play, and the super ghost is a Pokemon. The concealment is first and first, whether it's using psychic to refract light to hide, or use ghost ability to hide in Yibei's shadow. Neither will cause a riot. As for Solgaleo, Lyanna, I want to be by Lily's side. Solgaleo looked at Lily who had gone away. Yibei, okay. I respect your opinion. Gladian, his strength is about to be surpassed by a trainer who hasn't made his debut yet. What the hell is going on in this world? Although I feel envious that Yi Bei I and Lily have been recognized by the Sun God and Moon God respectively. But Gladian is also very happy that his sister Lily has been protected by a powerful Pokemon. At the same time, see Yi Bei I and Big Brother have not kept up. Lily immediately planned to say all the things she had kept silent in her stomach just now. I have something to tell you. Pouting angrily. Lily pulled Lusamin aside. Lusamin was stunned by some rude actions. Just for a moment, where did my caring and sensible daughter go? Mother, can you give me an explanation? What the hell is going on with you and Ebay? I? Why did you lie in his arms when you came out of Ultra Wormhole? Don't you know it's a mistake? Would love to say Lusamin has no shame, but the upbringing that has been cultivated for a long time makes Lily unable to say such words. Dot. Never thought that she would face her daughter's questioning. Lusamin was speechless for a while. How to say? Could it be that I made a mistake? Of course not. The situation didn't allow it to the time, and we were being hunted down by Lucas. Lusamin forcefully refuted, and found an unassailable reason. Anyway, now I have decided to start over, and I told Lily, just get this thing out of the way. No matter what happens in the future, it is not a mistake. Of course, she didn't dare to stimulate Lily's sensitive nerves too much. Well, that's all for now. Then can you tell me why you kept peeking at Yibei I just now? and even looked at him with a silly smile. Lily strikes again. The picture of Yibei Ai showing his face and smiling when he charged just now appeared in the good mind. Lusaman couldn't quibble anymore, but she wasn't helpless about it. Lily, you are so brave. Now I dare to question my mother, and I don't listen to my mother's words, right? Lusaman looked angry. Unsurprisingly, the coercion accumulated for a long time suppressed Lily. Despite seeing Lily's frightened look, it made Lusaman feel very distressed, but he had no choice but to be cruel now. Fortunately, this atmosphere did not last forever. Not long after, Yi Bei and Solgaleo appeared beside them. Gentlemen, it looks like the Courtney party is about to begin. We'll be right over. The conversation ended. Lily trotted to Yi Bei and Gladian's side. Lusamin walked behind, slightly relieved. At the same time, Yi Bei introduced Solgaleo's idea to Lily, and casually took out an ultra ball from the system space. Wow, Yi Bei, can you still? Adbk. 
Do magic. Lily took the Ultra Ball from Yu Bei with a look of surprise and subdued Solgaleo with this Ultra Ball. Okay, I got a Pokemon. Complete the conquest. Lily, with a single ponytail, lifted the Ultra Ball over her head full of energy, and then she looked thoughtful. I don't seem to be an adult yet. It's okay, you are a beast Pokemon, no one cares about it. Yu Bei smiled. He can think of Lily going on a trip in the future, and Trainer wrote about Trainer's desperate expression at the same time. Take the Vulpix. What a pity. You've worked so hard Vulpix, come back. It's up to you, Solgaleo. Rival, I hit Nima, surrender. PFFT ha ha ha. Yibei I burst out laughing. The laughter aroused the curiosity of Lily, Gladian and Lusamin. Yibei I what are you laughing at? Oh, nothing, I thought of something happy. Yibei I Solata on said perfunctorily. Walking into the crowd, Tubai saw Professor QQE who treated Ash like a father. And Mr. Island Kahuna Hor of Meli Mel Island. At this time, Solgaleo has been collected by Lily. Lunala sneaked into Yibei Ai's shadow. Huh? Ho'u stared at the Z-ring and Electron Z-pure crystal on Yibei Ai's wrist in surprise. You may not believe it, but my family just lost a set of Z-ring and Z-crystal. Huh? It's Yibei Ai's equipment, which was sent by Tapukoko. Yibei Ai hasn't spoken yet, the warm-hearted Lily has already nervously explained. I'm afraid that Yibei Ai will be treated as a thief. Hearing this, Ha'u smiled. Ha ha, I'm not doubting Mr. Yibei Ai is thief. In fact, I already guessed it was Tapukoko. Ha'u patted his stomach paused and said, I'm just a little surprised that Mr. Yibei I can be recognized by Tapu Koko. Indeed, a trainer who can be recognized by Tapu Koko is not normal. Recalling the picture of Yibei I poking his head out from next to Lusum and during the video call, combined with the huge body of Black Rayquaza in the background of the video. Professor QQE has confirmed the news of Yibei I Rayquaza trainer. He is not surprised that Yibei I can arouse Tapu's interest. Everyone is talking and laughing. Enjoy the Courtney party together. Period. In order to completely cut off the erroneous thoughts of my mother, Lily specially invited Yi Bei Ai to dance in front of Lu Samin. Dancing with the white moonlight in her heart, Lily is naturally very happy. This picture fell in Lu Samin's eyes. Seems like Lily found the missing fatherly love from Yi Bei Ai. The idea of taking down Yi Bei Ai became more and more determined. But Gladiant saw everything in his eyes, and he had the same idea as his mother Lu Samin. I think Lily found her long lost fatherly love in Yi Bei Ai. I hate my parents even more. But, considering that Lusaman has lost his way now, the rage in Delagio's heart quickly disappeared. Finished dancing with Lily. The good looks of Yi Bei I and Lily brought them warm applause. And dancing, send Lily back to her seat. Yi Bei I cast a glance from the corner of his eye and noticed Lusaman who was looking a little lonely in the corner. Thinking of the identity of the chairman of the opposing group. Probably haven't been to overheat soiree for Courtney in years. Yi Bei I felt that it was necessary to help Lusaman, to integrate into everyone's atmosphere. Yi Bei I got up under Lusaman's nervous gaze. He walked to the side and issued an invitation. May I invite you to dance with me, fair lady? Okay dot 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 okay. Rao is that Lusaman is used to strong winds and waves, but in the face of Yubei Ai, who is handsome, in line with his own aesthetics, and rescued him in a crisis, Lusaman still stuttered. She even ignored the feelings of Lily and Gladian. Stretch out a white and smooth hand, put it on the palm of Yubei Ai, holding Lusaman's soft and perfectly maintained jade hands. Yubei Ai pulled up Lusaman who was sitting on the ground, period, for the sake of angle, Yi Bei I inevitably saw a deep ravine, and two attractive white, huge gift crab, chapter 88 dance together, guard voya popsicles, Yi Bei I invited Lu Simon who put on a white dress, walked to the beach, a public area where the crowd voluntarily moves out of the way, Yi Bei I, I dot 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 it's my first time dancing dot tilde, Lu Simon's jewel like eyes stared at Yi Bei I, her long eyelashes blinked, some nervous jumping is not good, it's okay, the most important thing about a party is the atmosphere. It doesn't matter if it's professional or not. Yi Bei I said softly, stretch out your left hand and hold Lu Simon's white, smooth, and jade-like hand. The soft ice is cold and cool, which makes Yi Bei I a little bit fond of it. The right hand embraced Lu Simon's slender waist tightly bound by the white dress. Unexpectedly, it seems that the light shielding effect is very good, and the dress is basically opaque, but it is unexpectedly thin, even through the fabric. Yi Bei I can feel the warmth and feedback from Lu Simon's tender body and Lusaman also became more and more nervous, but, as time flows, Yi Bei's gentleness and consideration, Alola resident's friendly encouragement, let Lusaman's tense emotions gradually relax, the beautiful face was also replaced by joy from the heart, Gladian watched the scene, although it feels a little strange, I am also happy for my mother's happiness, and as Stephanie's son, the more emotional Lily saw this scene, but couldn't accept it at all, no, I can't let my mother continue to make mistakes, it's decided, she wants to pursue Yi Bei Ai. What are you talking about Lily? Gladian turned around with some doubts, looking at the younger sister who clenched her fists, her arms were raised in front of her chest, and her childish and cute face showed a bit of firm expression. 
Ah, it's nothing. I'm going to the bathroom. Discovered by Gladian. The firmness on Lily's face dissipated instantly, showing an awkward yet polite smile. He raised his hands and shook them in front of him. Get up and run away. All right. Watching his sister run away, knowing that she didn't want to say it, Gladian didn't force it either. At the same time, the eyes fell on Ebay and Lucerman who were very happy to get along with the crowd. Professor Burnett, sitting in the corner of the crowd, is full of gossip. QQE, you said Yebei I and Chairman Lu Simon, what is the situation? Although surprisingly, but I guess it should be mutual affection, it's really unexpected that Chairman Lu Simon would like a man of this age. Watching a beautiful scene unfold in front of me, QQE couldn't help but put his arms around the waist of his wife, Professor Burnett, body leaning forward sideways. Damn, there are still a lot of people here. Professor Burnett shyly pushed QQE away, it's okay, right now they're all looking at Yebei I, who is both handsome and beautiful, and Chairman Lu Simon, no one will see it. In the end, QQE persuaded Professor Burnett with extremely convincing arguments, and he got his wish. Too much. Professor QQE, while the crowd was indeed looking at Yebei I and Lu Simon. But good things can't always be seen, especially under spotlight like now. It is easy to cause some embarrassment. Therefore, Yebei I's eyes did not stay on Lu Simon for a long time, with a quick glance. He happened to notice the two of them. Following Yibei I's line of sight, Lusamin also noticed the actions of the two, and swallowed subconsciously. The atmosphere is just right for the end, for a Carlos-style romance. Unfortunately, the situation does not allow. Lily and Gladian are still watching from below. Huh? Where's Lily? As if I sensed my mother's probing gaze, Gladian glanced at the direction in which Lily disappeared, and followed with concern, seeing that the two children disappeared. Lusamin felt nervous. The dance steps started to speed up. Soon. The continuous high-frequency dance steps dragged down Lu Simin, rapid loss of strength. It made her unable to keep up with Yi Bei's rhythm gradually, and finally threw herself into Yi Bei's arms, surprised Yi Bei and everyone. Yi Bei stretched out both hands instinctively to protect Lu Simin. Are you all right? Yi Bei worried nervously. No dot 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 it's okay, it's just that the foot may have been photographed. Lu Simin frowned in pain, seeing this. The surrounding people gathered around with concern. It's okay. Chairman Lu Simon. Normally Lu Simon's ether foundation takes care of the residents in their hometown. Everyone cares about Lu Simon from the bottom of their hearts, and they are very worried about her. It's okay, let's continue. Don't lose interest because of me. Lu Simon endured the pain and leaned on Yibei I. Yibei I, help me to the side. Okay, go on everyone, I'll take care of Lu Simon. Yibei I comforted the enthusiastic Alola people, using his body as a crutch. He helped Lu Simon limp to the corner. If you sprain, use this. Professor QQE took out a bottle of sprain medicine, just when Yibei I was going to call QQE to stop and let the other party call Professor Burnett over. QQE seemed to know Yibei I's thoughts in advance, just slipped away and took away Professor Burnett. This. I looked around and saw that even Gladian and Lily were gone. Yibei I had no choice but to come by himself. Sorry, offended. Yibei I sat on the beach, lifted Lu Simon's twisted left foot, took off the shoe on Lu Simon's left foot, spray the liquid medicine on the palm of your hand, rub it. It is necessary to apply it on the red and swollen parts of the crystal clear feet, don't. It's dirty. Hiss. Lusamin hasn't finished speaking yet. The liquid medicine has already been applied to the injured area, and the powerful medicine effect kicks in, and the pain makes Lusamin take a breath, while frowning on his pretty face, he was moved in his heart. I'm rubbing it for you so that the medicine can penetrate into it. Seeing Lusamin's painful appearance, Yibei's hand movements became more gentle. As time goes by, the pain subsides. Lusamin's wrinkled expression gradually eased, but unfortunately, this scene happened to be reflected in the eyes of Lily and Gladian who returned. Master, what are you? It's not what you think. Yibei I explained the general situation embarrassingly. After the misunderstanding was resolved, Lily took over Yibei I's job. That night, Yibei I escorted the two girls back to their villa on Melumel Island. Lusamin asked the housekeeper to arrange a room for Yibei I, which was opposite the master bedroom. All of these are seen by Lily. After writing the diary in my own room, I will lock the photo taken with Yibei I in the diary. Lily hugged the pillow, stepped on two white stockings, and went straight to her mother's room. Zero dot 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 asking for flowers. She wants to single guard against Lu Simin, prevent the mother from making more egregious mistakes. Lu Simin, who didn't know it, gave Lily a lot of patience. He slept with her all night. At the same time, being tortured by Lu Simin, which he could see but not eat, Yibei I was very depressed. Fortunately, Ms. not by my side for the time being, but say guard voyeur is still by my side. Tonight. A strange thing happened that puzzled the housekeeper, do not know why, there is always a psychedelic light flickering in the villa tonight. Early the next morning, when Ebei I woke up, he felt something cool and slippery next to his face. Open your eyes and see, it is a cream-colored cone-shaped popsicle, which looks white and smooth, very attractive. Ebei I, whose consciousness was a little fuzzy, tasted it a little bit, 
<laughs> Sweet. Well, there is a special aroma. Oh no. The body of the heterochromatic guard void trembled slightly, and a more attractive body fragrance aroused from his body. The cool and scent of guard void. Let you be I gradually come to smelling salts, until now. Dot 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 zero. He just realized that the sweet and fragrant popsicle just now, looks like guard voyeur's jade feet. Only guard voyeur never wears shoes. In addition, the body has been floating in the air, and comes with fairy body fragrance. Not only is it not smelly at all, it is also very delicate and fragrant. After unintentionally unlocking new knowledge, Yi Bei I, who came over from smelling salts thoroughly, got up and washed up briefly. After breakfast with Lu Samin, Lily, Gladian, Yi Bei I proposed to leave under the astonishment on Lu Samin's face. But before leaving, however, Yi Bei I also invited the two girls to the underground world. It was a little surprise for the two girls, when they discover the mysteries of the underground world. They will naturally not have to worry about not seeing him in the future. Yi Bei I released Rayquaza, sitting on the back of Rayquaza, flying towards Kanto. Until flying out of Alola, Yi Bei I chose to enter the underground world and returned directly to Kanto through teleportation. I don't know if I haven't returned one day, what are Serena, and Annabelle doing? At the same time, Yi Bei I's departure inflicted a huge mental blow on Lu Samin. the lost one went back to the room, on the big soft bed, Lu Samin fell into a long silence, obviously everything seemed to be fine yesterday, and there was even a hint of love between the two, Doctor, thoughtful, Lu Samin opened Yi Bei Ai's social account, find the video of M and Yi Bei Ai fighting side by side, comparing myself with M, although her figure is indeed better than M, but as long as you are a normal person, you will probably choose a young and beautiful girl like M, right? What's more, she is already a parent, with two children. After all, I am the one who climbed high. Wake up, now think about it. Lu Simon only felt that yesterday's self was very ridiculous. Can such a self really win Yi Bei Ai's love? Perhaps, it is only possible to do it if you share it with others. Shook his head, to banish the last unrealistic thought from my mind, Lu Simon tried not to think about these things. Let me study it. What is this underground world? What exactly is it? Chapter 89 Goodbye Cabbage Sister Cynthia Ability Modification Underworld, Kanta Region Yi Bei Ai planned to go back to the hotel directly. But when he opened the mini-map, he saw that there were still people in the underground world, but only in Sinar region. Out of curiosity, Yi Bei I flew all the way and arrived near the red dot. Stepping out, Yi Bei I's figure appeared in the secret realm. Humid air blows in, the figure of Yi Bei I appeared on a cliff. The front convenience is a vast expanse, and at a glance, there is no end to the super large lake. In the lake, a huge figure is frying fish, fried fish in the physical sense, punch after punch, falling toward the lake. Knock out Jayardos one by one and gain a lot of combat experience. Regagagas at level 85. Yi Bei I was a little stunned. Retraction of sight. Looking at the two beautiful figures on the edge of the cliff, wearing a black close fitting suit and slim fit trousers with purple hair, even with his back to Yi Bei I, but her round buttocks, and Raikou standing beside her, have already betrayed each other's identity. Annabelle, as for the other one, a head of gold and waist length hair is parted behind the back, a moon Pokemon headgear with very personal characteristics a tall and straight height, and the exquisite and perfect figure of 057, Annabelle and Cynthia, question mark you have entered the secret realm of you, Lake, tip falls, Yi Bei I walked up to the two women suspiciously, why are you here and what's up with this regagagas, the two women turned their heads when they heard a voice, Yi Bei I, you are here, Annabelle took the initiative to say hello to Yi Bei I, and introduced Cynthia and met regagagas, and for the safety of other Pokemon in the secret realm, Cynthia used a master ball to temporarily subdue Regagagas. You finally appeared Yi Bei Ai. Seeing Yi Bei Ai's handsome face, a long lost smile flashed across Cynthia's beautiful, luxurious and intellectual face. At the same time, thinking that even Annabelle, Yi Bei Ai's colleague, was drawn into the underground world, I seemed to have misunderstood Yi Bei Ai before. A look of shame flashed across her fair and smooth pretty face. By the way, I want to ask Yi Bei Ai for your opinion on how to deal with this Regagagas. Cynthia spoke out what was most concerned about him at the moment. Although the Regagagas were subdued, let her consume a very precious master ball in the family, but if this Regagagas exists, it will affect the secret environment of the underground world, and Cynthia will not keep it selfishly. At this point, Cynthia maintains the same position as Yi Bei Ai. Train him well. Yi Bei Ai withdrew his gaze from the beauty, his eyes fell on Regagagas, who was waving his arms to fry fish as if his movements were half a beat slow, repeating the mechanical attack again and again, it is impossible to say that Cynthia has not been recognized by Regagagas. If I'm not mistaken, Regagagas he, should have recognized Cynthia you. Is that so? Following Yi Bei Ai's gaze, Cynthia's eyes fell on Regagagas. Indeed, if Regagagas didn't approve of her, it would be impossible for her to be willing to follow her command to fry fish here. Successfully obtained a legendary Pokemon, it is also the legendary Titan Pokemon that has absolute power in legendary. 
enough to pull the migration of the continent. Cynthia is very happy. At the same time, I am very grateful to Yubei I. Without Yubei I, it would be impossible for him to subdue the Regagagas in front of him. By the way, Yubei I, I've heard it from Ansarina. The items Doug will come to you. I want to ask you to use ability ointment for my Garchomp, please. Cynthia's delicate red lips lifted slightly, her jewel-like blue eyes and long eyelashes blinked. Fold your hands on your lower abdomen, bow your body slightly, and lean forward. The proud curve is inclined. Even if there is no snow-white scenery, it will make people feel that Cynthia is full of charm at the moment. Even asking for help, Cynthia's body is full of intellectual and noble beauty. Of course that's fine. Opening the system backpack, Yubei I took a look at the high inventory of ability which has almost doubled. It seems that Cynthia and Annabelle have contributed a lot to him. To what is the adamant orb? The exclusive prop of the god of time. With a thought. Between Yubei I's hands, appeared a polygonal orb with one side and one side, shining with a brilliance of diamonds. Adamant orb. I dug this up. See the adamant orb, a legendary item that existed in ancient times. Cynthia who loves archaeology very much, with two slender and round legs. He walked up to Yubei I. There is a trace of joy and wonder in the sapphire-like eyes. Delighted to meet Adamant Orb. What a beautiful creation. Compared with its appearance, what is its specific function? Annabelle, who does not like cultural relics, is not interested in the appearance of the Adamant Orb. She wanted to know more about the origin and purpose of the Adamant Orb. This is the god of time. Dialga's exclusive props, the law of time with rich connotations, can greatly strengthen Dialga's strength. Of course, common Pokemon can also comprehend the law of time but it is extremely difficult. It is very likely that in his whole life, he has never comprehended even a trace of the law of time. It's not that Yubei I is deliberately exaggerating. The law of time is the highest level and the most difficult to comprehend among many laws. Even if it is given to a top beast like Rayquaza, it may not be able to master it, let alone common Pokemon. Law of time. Two beauties, whether it is Cynthia, who is full of intellectual nobility and steady work, or Annabelle, who is confident and capable, with a strong feminine temperament. All of them widened their beautiful eyes in surprise. Looking at the sight of Adam and Orb, he became very serious. Especially Cynthia, knowing that Sinar region also has the existence of Adam and Orb. The importance of this item was quickly realized. After you go back, you must transfer it as soon as possible. It is best to move to Alliance headquarters, where the champions work. Okay, let's not talk about the Adam and Orb. Let's talk about the ability ointment. Cynthia, which Pokemon do you want to change ability? Yubei I asked curiously. It's Garchomp and Milotic. Due to the underground world, you can see the attributes of your Pokemon more accurately in the help trainer, therefore, Cynthia purposely, confirmed, in the end, Garchomp and Milotic were specially selected for modification. Yubei I distributed the ability ointment to the two Pokemon, Garchomp ability has been changed to strong jaw, the power of biting moves is increased by 50%. This ability is very simple and easy to understand, and Melodic's ability has become a leisurely swim, and the speed doubles in rainy days. At the same time Yubei I let Cynthia and Garchomp complete Mega Evolution. After Mega Evolution, Garchomp's ability is changed to Sand Power, the power of sand, under sandstorm weather, the power of rock gang's ground type moves is increased by 50%. This book sets, this kind of ability is the same as the unified 50%. The power of sand can further enhance the output of Garchomp again, in theory. It is a very good ability. But in fact, it is not practical. You must know that after Mega Evolution, Garchomp's attack species strength is a full 170, which has already been raised to an extremely terrifying level. The power of sand can only be icing on the cake. The price in exchange is that after Mega Evolution, the speed of Mega Garchomp drops from 102 to 92, easily kited, pulled by rival. After thinking about it, Yubei I suggested modifying it to an ability that can improve speed. Cynthia also felt that Yubei I's idea was very reasonable. It's just that two ability ointments have already been consumed, but it still needs to be consumed, which makes Cynthia feel a little sorry for Yubei I, but Yubei I himself is completely indifferent. Thanks to Cynthia, he doubled the amount of ability salve and also unlocked the corresponding level of Sinar region. Consume some ability ointment, no problem at all. What Yubei I is worried about is another problem. After Mega Garchomp takes Ability Ointment, whether Common Garchomp's Strong Jaw ability will change. 5.1 Ending is not. In the end, Mega Garchomp's ability was modified to make Sand. In Sandstorm weather, the speed is doubled, and the speed of 92 directly changes to 184, which is an amazing improvement. Yubei I, you seem happy? Cynthia looked puzzled. Sand pulling ability, she's never heard of it. Naturally, I don't know how terrifying its actual effect is. The sight falls on Garchomp's level 91. I remember not long ago, when supporting Necrozma in a lower region. The level of Dragonite has also been raised to 91, same grade, coupled with the fact that Dragonite holds the power of Gigamax, and Garchomp holds the power of Mega Evolution, 
Yi Bei couldn't help feeling a strong fighting spirit in his heart. How about this, let's fight in person, and I will tell you how to use this ability. You experience it yourself in battle, how can it improve you? Really? Cynthia's jewel-like eyes shine, compete with Yi Bei, the legendary trainer who conquered Rayquaza, thinking about Xida being a little excited. She suddenly became extremely excited, excited, and serious. Dot. Chapter 90 Yi Bei vs Cynthia Mega Evolution Victory Yi Bei summoned Dragonite, came to a small island in this secret place. This small island is nearly a thousand square meters, and the island is very flat. It's like a natural battlefield. Latios, please build a barrier. Facing the early Pokemon battle of two masters, Annabelle sent Latios, one of the three trump cards, a super dragon, to protect her. Yi Bei and Cynthia, thanks. Yi Bei, Cynthia, at the same time expressed their thanks to Annabelle. At the same time, looking at each other. Dragonite and Garchomp are also ready for battle. Both sides are quasi-gods, whoever loses is embarrassing. Looking at each other's eyes, the fighting spirit is almost as strong as substance, sand bashing is very similar to Milotic's ease of swimming, it is a type of ability. The difference is that sand blasting works on sandstorm weather, while leisurely travel works on rainy days. In certain weather, the speed is doubled. Before the battle, Yi Bei introduced two abilities, as clever as Cynthia. She soon knew that Sand Blasting was the best match for Mega Garchomp. For a time, the heart is more excited. Then you're welcome, Mega Evolution. Enter the battle contest condition. Cynthia's intellectual and noble temperament suddenly changed. Her jewel-like eyes were extremely sharp. In the dazzling splendor, Garchomp completed Mega Evolution. In addition to speed and physical strength, all abilities have been improved, and the attack has been greatly improved. Don't be too happy, my Dragonite and I are not so easy to lose. Dragonite is extremely large. Let him see your true strength. Dazzling white light enveloped Dragonite's body. In the white light, Dragonite's size expanded rapidly, and soon reached the level of 100 meters. The gigantic giants and mythical beasts that are far larger than normal. Uh, the sky-shattering dragon chant spewed out from Dragonite's mouth, like the roar of an ancient giant beast. The wild water-type Pokemon in the secret realm lowered their heads in fear, facing such a terrifying huge figure at close range. Huge size, Garchomp can't see the huge Dragonite's head at a glance. Coupled with the intimidating dragon chant, Garchomp was startled, subconsciously took two steps back. Even Regagagas in the distance was startled by this sudden change. Dragonite, what a big body, twice as big as him. In the game, there are two battle systems, perhaps Mega Evolution is more excellent. After all, it can support the whole game. However, extreme giantization can only last three rounds, and in addition to the improvement of physical strength, there is only the advantage of extremely huge skills. But the reality is not so. Changes in body shape will bring about closely related changes, just like the gigantic Dragonite at the moment. Flying speed dropped sharply. In exchange, the strength, dual resistance, and physical strength have all been greatly increased, especially when paired with Hercules. The strength is doubled. At this moment, the power of the extremely giant Dragonite has reached an extremely terrifying level. About this point, Primal Ground had something to say. Even if the level gap is huge, the huge Dragonite can still win in the pure competition of strength. And because of Yi Bei's Dragonite, the body has a lot of extreme energy. There is no limit of three rounds for the extremely large contest condition. As long as the Dragonite does not lose physical strength, it can be maintained forever. Is this the extreme giant phenomenon mentioned in the Interpol report? But, it's useless if it's just a big body. Garchomp, Waterfall. Cynthia deserves to be the strongest female champion. The insight is nuanced, not only noticing that Garchomp's fighting spirit has faded. With just one sentence, Garchomp's gradually sinking fighting spirit was mobilized. The wild sand swept across, and an extremely strong sandstorm hit, covering the battlefield. Sand pulling ability triggers, in the sandstorm environment. The mysterious energy in Mega Garchomp is activated. The body becomes lighter, not only will it not be attacked by sandstorm, but it will be like a fish in water, and it can even faintly affect the flow of sandstorm. The speed is doubled directly. Ice punch, under the extremely giant contest condition. You can also use non-giant moves. At this moment, Yi Bei is planning to give it a try. Only, much to Yi Bei's disappointment, compared to the Giga moves used with Gigamax, Pokemon with a very large body shape use common moves, often due to poor adaptability, resulting in a very low hit rate. It cannot effectively damage the enemy. Just like the gigantic Dragonite at this moment, the waving of the right fist brought up a gust of wind, which almost directly blew away Sandstorm on the field. Above the huge Dragon Claw, covered with a layer of deep blue ice crystals, exuding deadly low temperature, stay out of the way, Dragon Rush, Garchomp played the speed to the extreme under Sandstorm, in an instant, he avoided the attack from the huge Dragonite, Body Flash, Mega Garchomp appeared high in the sky, the giant Dragonite attached to the frozen giant Dragon Claw also landed on the island, Dot.
a huge force of hundreds of thousands of tons hit the island, and the island under everyone's feet trembled violently. The shock wave extended to the lake through the ley lines, causing waves of tsunamis to hit the shore. Just the aftermath of the attack stunned a large number of water-type Pokemon along the way, harvesting a lot of experience. Dragonclaw lifts up, where the island was hit, there was a huge dent directly in front of Dragonite. Ground is fragile like jelly normal. Dragon Rush Massive Zan Blue's energy stance, enveloping the Mega Garchomp in the sky. Packed with violent power, Garchomp wields the huge scythe after Mega Evolution. Boom! Mega Garchomp tried his best to strike, although it failed to break Dragonite's skin, it also brought substantial damage to Dragonite. Dragonite felt a sharp pain in his abdomen. Okay, the experiment is over. I hope you and Mega Garchomp can dodge the next move. Max Hailstorm. Dragonite flaps its wings and the cold Horatio hurts above the sky, located above the head of Mega Garchomp, the gate of the dimension opens, a big snowball like a comet fell from the sky and hit Mega Garchomp, flight to Dragonite, facing the big snowball that looks like meteorite, Cynthia quickly made a judgment, knowing that you are invincible, choose to weaken the attack to an acceptable range, Mega Garchomp flew in the direction of the huge Dragonite with all 440 force, but it was a step too late after all, the back half of Mega Garchomp's body was hit by the edge of a huge snowball, and the body was embedded in the ground at once, as the big snowball falls to the ground, instantly turned into a burst of extremely strong frost energy, spreading in all directions, Mega Garchomp suffered two consecutive targeted blows with quadruple restraint, can't take it anymore, degenerated back to the basic form of Garchomp, his eyes turned in circles, and he lost the ability to fight, Garchomp is out of combat, so the winner is Yi Bei I, Annabelle, who temporarily turned into the referee, was amazed in his heart, and decisively pronounced the final result. Have to say, in a battle that does not involve the level of lore, the combat power bonus of the extreme battle system is really outrageous. That last attack dot 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 couldn't even be dodged by the doubled up Mega Garchomp. Cynthia fell into distressed thought. It seems that, if you have time, you must study the extremely large battle system. Speaking of which, at present, the only successful case of extreme giantization in the world seems to be Yi Bei Ai's huge Dragonite. In this case, I can only run to the underground world if I have nothing to do, and be quiet with Yi Bei Ai more, and establish enough friendship. Boom. Suddenly there was a loud noise from a distance. Yi Bei Ai took a glance from the corner of his eye. It was found that Regagagas was knocked down by the aftermath of the attack and sat down in the sea, looking at each other's slow start ability. Yi Bei Ai was thoughtful. Cynthia, your Regagagas. Better modify your ability too. Chapter 91 Revising Regagagas. Tune in Groudon. Regagagas. Is his ability bad? Cynthia's beautiful face showed curiosity. Slow start is not very good. This ability Pokemon enters the contest condition late in everything. It's a bit like not waking up. After playing. He felt weak and could only exert half of his normal strength. Or even less than half of his strength. That's why at that time. Cynthia widened her beautiful eyes in surprise. Recalling the weak side that Regagagas showed in the first battle. And after being subdued. Regagaga's performance in the early stages of leveling was always unsatisfactory, before Cynthia thought it was Regagaga's who ignored her and Garchomp, and did not recognize her performance, unexpectedly, the real reason is that ability is at work, how can there be such an ability with side effects, on Cynthia's alluring face, in her jewel-like eyes, she looked at the huge Regagaga's with pity, Yi Bei Ai, you seem to have a lot of research on Pokemon ability, Annabelle interrupted suddenly, it's not that I know more, it's that my authority is higher than yours, so I know more information. Yi Bei I smiled and blamed the system. I have a doubt. One of our colleagues, who captured Dark Eops, the revived fossil Pokemon from the Unova region, at the beginning of the battle against 647, Archeops can often show impressive strength, crushing rival with overwhelming strength and speed. But once he gets into a hard fight, he will perform poorly, so is his ability a quick start. Remembering the Archeops captured by a colleague, powerful strength, a speed of 40 km per hour, However, the performance in battle was rather disappointing, unavoidably, Annabelle has a reasonable association, indeed, the ability of Archeops is weakness, once the physical value drops below half, the fighting spirit in his heart will fade away, and he can only perform half of the normal level, or even less than half, it's kind of like the opposite of slow start, but in fact the two are slightly different, conversation room, Cynthia took Regagagas back and released it again, in public, Yi Bei I didn't deliberately hide his flying ability, the two present, one is an insider, and the other is temporarily unaware, but with the existence of Black Rayquaza, how much can guess about it? Yi Bei I simply flew directly in front of Regagagas, took the ability ointment for him, question mark ability, strong, let's forget about this, while, adb, sighing, Yi Bei I introduced the general effect of ability to the two girls, at the same time throw one again, question mark ability, slow, question mark ability, sense of oppression, it is actually exclusive to the noble beast Pokemon, although the sense of oppression in the game seems to be rubbish, 
But actually, well, reality is pretty rubbish too. Although the sense of oppression will make Rival feel intimidated and dare not make a move, it is about equal to the start of the game with its own field control, but it's not really practical. Divine Beast Pokemon already have an overwhelming advantage, no fear of common Pokemon, and if Rival is a beast, it will not be affected by oppression. It seems that the potential is unlimited, but in fact it can only abuse food. Question mark ability, Hercules? Almost at the moment when Hercules ability appeared. The image of Regagigas began to become taller and mightier. At one point, his height reached 80 meters, and his limbs became stronger and stronger. Such an astonishing change. Naturally, it attracted the attention of the three of them. This is fine. Yibei I sighed, double the power. Not only is it practical, but it also fits the legendary story of Regagigas being able to use chains to move continents. Double the strength. Cynthia and Annabelle's beautiful eyes widened in surprise. Does such an ability really exist? Unbelievable. While the two women were amazed. They subconsciously shook their heads, it's hard to understand that there is such a powerful ability. But the size of Regagigas in front of him has almost doubled. But the two women had to believe it. About this point, you two, let's try it together and we'll know. Eyeing the giant Dragonite and Regagigas, thinking of the arrogant and disobedient primal Groudon not long ago, Yibei I decided to take this opportunity to teach Groudon well. Come out, Gulalu oh. The Ultra Ball opens, primal Groudon's gigantic body appears in the lake, question mark level. 158, incorporating the red orb only raised Groudon's level from 155 to 158, on par with Black Rayquaza, the same fusion orb, mastering the law and authority in it. But because Groudon suffered too many beatings in the process of fusing the orbs, almost all the energy in the body is consumed in battle, not fully developed and utilized. The level increase is really small, but, in the legendary realm, the level is not the most important, the comprehension of the law is the key to improve the combat power. As soon as Primal Groudon's huge body appeared, it occupied a large area of the lake, and the height of the lake rose linearly. At the same time, the ambient temperature in the secret realm is also rising rapidly. The hot magma tumbled into the cool lake water, sizzling. The sound of the lake evaporating is endless. A mass of white mist envelops Groudon. Dragonite, Dragon Rush. The huge Dragonite flapped its wings behind, and its huge body of hundreds of meters flew into the sky. Zan Blue's energy abnormally wrapped around the body of the giant Dragonite. What Yi Bei did? Let the two women understand the meaning of trying. But 91 attack level 158, is this really possible? Looking at the disparity between the two sides, Cynthia and Annabelle looked at each other, shaking their heads secretly. It's hard to imagine that Dragonite's attack could have an impact on Primal Groudon. However, to the surprise of the two women, the huge Dragonite trapped in Chenwood's energy force field swooped down from a high altitude, and a fist with blue light landed on the somewhat dazed Primal Groudon's head, smashing Primal Groudon's head into the lake without any effort. Boom. There was a loud bang. Primal Groudon's head had a violent contact with the bottom of the lake. His head was smashed into the mud. Groudon felt dizzy. What happened? At the same time, the violent impact accompanied the bottom of the lake and spread to the entire secret realm. The earth trembled violently. Cynthia and Annabelle were unstable, sitting down on the beach, and exclaimed, Ah! After the shock, Cynthia and Annabelle, who were sitting on the beach, stared in disbelief, unexpectedly. The huge Dragonite's attack actually worked. Taking a quick glance at the ability Hercules on the Dragon-type panel, this, on Cynthia's beautiful face, eager to try, Groudon is a mythical beast, it should be very resistant to beating, how about trying? Chapter 92 Conquer Groudon Lusaman is attacked, Regagigas, Mega Punch. Just when Primal Groudon pulled his head out of the mud and shook his head, and he still didn't understand the situation, Regagigas moved his legs, tens of thousands of tons of bodies stomped on the lake and the ground trembled continuously. Layer after layer of huge waves swayed on the lake, oppressive, walked up to Primal Groudon. Cool. Regagigas waved his fist with all his strength, and the fist with a dazzling white light made a harsh sound burst. Boom. A punch hit Primal Gurado's stomach hard. Primal Groudon's tens of thousands of tons of body was instantly blown away, like a kite with a broken string, it fell towards the lake. Boom. Crash. Primal Groudon's body is like a cannonball, and the 10, 000 ton force it carries explodes on the water surface. The lake set off huge waves and rushed in all directions. Even if the grades fall behind, but the power displayed by the two Hercules Pokemon is amazing. What a power. The level is behind, and the strength even surpasses Dragonite. Both Cynthia and Annabelle widen their beautiful eyes in surprise, can only say, as expected of Regagigas represented by strength. The strength under the blessing of Hercules is so terrifying. At the same time, the earth trembled again. Cynthia and Annabelle, who had just stood up from the beach, fell to the ground again. Although the humming sounds of the two women are very pleasant, but this kind of feeling is very bad. Latios, Togekiss, the two girls respectively summoned flying Pokemon and came to the sky to avoid being fought by Piggy and others again. At the same time, 
Primal Groudon has finally regained his mobility. Precipice Blades. The rich earth power gathered at the bottom of the lake, and the scarlet-colored rock blades suddenly emerged from under Regagigas. Regagigas defenseless, the bodies of tens of thousands of tons were lifted into the air by Precipice Blades. The body suffered great damage, Regagigas' eyes instantly circled, and he lost his ability to fight. Kill in one hit. Seeing that Regagigas never got up again, Primal Groudon's eyes quickly turned to Dragonite. Come back. Dragonite. Yi Bei certainly doesn't expect to rely on level 91 Dragonite, and Cynthia's level 85 Regagigas to teach Groudon a lesson. To deal with people who can't fly, they have to be professional. Go. Black Rayquaza. Enemies are jealous when they meet each other. Without Yi Bei's command, the two sides fought instantly. Dazzling light particles spit out from Primal Groudon's mouth. The scorching high temperature makes the temperature in the environment rise again and again. Destroy the Death Ray. Rayquaza's dragon mouth opened and it also spewed out fiery light particles, two light paths meet in the air, a violent explosion occurred, and the shock wave swept in all directions, sending everything along the way flying, the two sides are at the same level, plus the durability of the beast, the battle went on for a long time, however, Groudon's life seems to exist to set off Rayquaza, the end result is undeniable, land of the end ability is suppressed, under the delta airflow, Groudon was suppressed by Rayquaza all the way, and he dealt with him severely, coupled with Rayquaza's absolute air supremacy, Groudon was beaten and fled. Although still very dissatisfied in my heart, after this battle, Groudon, who was kicked out of the primal reversion contest condition, knew he was not Black Rayquaza's rival, reluctantly recognized the identity of Ebei trainer. At least until he overtakes the obnoxious Rayquaza, Groudon was willing to listen. Come back. After solving Groudon's problem, Ebei put away the two beasts. The figure of Ebei flew to the side of the two women, it seems that in three days, Cynthia will participate in the knockout round of the World Championship 8 Masters. Yi Bei remembered the news he saw not long ago, thinking that now Cynthia already holds Regagigas, even without Regagigas, Garchomp of Mighty Jaws and Sand Ability, and Milotic, who is free and easy, is enough to raise Cynthia's combat power to a higher level. Yi Bei I can't wait, I want to see Cynthia smashing the quartet in the World Championship as soon as possible, after all. The rise of Cynthia is also inseparably related to him, yes, as if remembering happy things. Cynthia's beautiful face is full of smiles, so that her charm can be fully displayed. Heart pounding. Yi Bei I also laughed. I'm already expecting you to win the championship. Thank you very much. A trace of gratitude flashed across Cynthia's pretty face. She did not expect. There are still such amazing things in this world, as hard as it is to believe. There is also an underground world in the Pokemon world. But everything she experienced in front of her told Cynthia that it was all real. Also, I will wait for you. Ah, thinking that with Yi Bei's strength. He will definitely win the world championship in the future, be her biggest rival, Cynthia subconsciously said the invitation to fight, however, until the words fell, Cynthia just realized that what she said seems to be very ambiguous, fair and smooth, delicate beauty, a flash of anxiety flashed by, I mean, next year's world championships are waiting for you, I know, Yi Bei I smiled, however, although there is no me this year, you still work hard, don't miss this opportunity, perhaps, this will be your perfect chance to be the closest to being a world champion in your life. And I, will be the man who will become the world champion. Crazy enough. Cynthia's beautiful eyebrows sparkled, but he didn't feel that Yi Bei I was just dreaming. Based on the number of legendary Pokemon under Yi Bei I, if Yi Bei I sends them on the field, winning the world championship is like eating and drinking. It's the man of the world champion. Cynthia fell silent. Glancing at Annabelle who was also silent beside him, Cynthia confirmed that it wasn't her thinking too much. It's Yi Bei I's way of speaking which is easy to make people think wrong. Yi Bei I, I have something to tell you. Annabelle took Yi Bei I away. Cynthia continues to indulge in battle leveling. Leave secret. Zero dot ask for flowers. Yi Bei I and Annabelle came to a secret base. The plan to destroy the rockets. Are you sure you want to put yourself at risk and enter the Viking gym to drag Giovanni? Annabelle has a serious face, with a look of deep worry. Certainly, thinking of the battle with Giovanni, Yi Bei I is full of fighting spirit in his heart. Yi Bei I's long-awaited battle with Giovanni's mute bow. This may be Yi Bei I's only chance. After all, after this time, Mutuo will no longer belong to Seikada. And with the secret protection of Lunala, even if Giovanni wants to play dirty tricks, he will not succeed. But you don't have a powerful psychic type Pokemon, but rival. Annabelle frowned. In her opinion, letting Yi Bei I risk her life is not as good as entrusting this job to her. Don't worry, I know what's going on. Yi Bei I smiled mysteriously at Annabelle, leaving a hint of suspense. At the same time, after dealing with work matters, Lusaman entered the underground world. Dot 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 zero. For the underground world, Lusaman was very curious, even though she didn't carry any Pokemon. But out of curiosity, she went to the secret realm. Unfortunately, 
The secret realm I entered happened to be an evil secret realm with an extremely harsh environment. Most of the Pokemon inside are of the evil type, not only aggressive, but also have a strong desire to attack. When passing a pool of water, a sharp head pops out, narrowly missing Lusamin, leaning on twisted feet. Lusamin groaned and fell to the ground, dodged Sharp Edo's main attack, but also inevitably scratched by Sharp Edo's rough skin. There were a few bloodstains on the white and clean left arm. It hurts. Lusamin took a breath, her delicate and beautiful facial features wrinkled, and her white teeth were clenched. At this time, Sharp Edo, with a single blow, turned his body on the ground with red eyes. Try Samin. Accelerate through the tail jet and attack again. Lusamin, who created a consortium by himself. The mind is undoubtedly very clever, although the situation is critical now. He quickly calmed down. Did not run away rashly, but at the moment when Sharpedo is about to launch Sucker Punch, make a perfect prediction in advance, roll towards the side. Sharpedo watched Lusamin fly sideways, powerless, another smack down empty. Regardless of the pain in the ankle and arm, covering the bleeding wound with her hands and gritting her teeth, Lusamin fled towards the entrance. And what Lusamin didn't notice was that, not far from the entrance, behind a big tree with both hands clasped, a sable eye sticks out its head, noticed her from afar. There was a bloodthirsty light in the jewel-like pupils. Ye bay I hear. Suddenly, a reminder came to the ear. The invited target Lusamon is in danger of life, and has now provided the location of the target to the host. Do you want to teleport? Chapter 93 Rescue and Conquer Take down Lusamon. With a deep purple body, Sableye is as small as a goblin. After discovering that there is no poke ball in Lusamon's waist, after actively walking out of the tree, a layer of ghost energy was attached to Deep Purple's claws. Question mark Sableye Question mark Level 70 the moment Lusamon saw the data panel pop up, Lusamon stopped. Despite Sableye's size, she looks so small that she doesn't even reach her thighs. But grades don't lie. Level 70 Pokemon are not something that common humans can deal with. Just escaped from Sharpedo's mouth, it can only be said that it is a racial advantage. Water Sharpedo is not suitable for fighting and moving on ground. But Sableye is different. Although small in size, it is a real land type Pokemon. Is she actually going to die here? Lusamon didn't back down. She knows that once she backs off Sableye will realize her weakness and attack, but in this case, obviously it can't last long. Seeing that Lusamon has not moved for a long time, feel the hunger in the stomach, Sableye is already a little impatient. The long and narrow mouth was split open, exposing two rows of thick teeth. Give four six three hun. Sableye let out a shriek, in a flash, he soared into the air, and slashed down with his right claw, leaves three ghostly scratches in the air. Ah! Lusamon screamed and closed her eyes subconsciously preparing to face the end of death. Seeing that the food was settled, Sableye's eyes lit up, and the saliva flowed down from his mouth. Close call. The strong wind hit Ye Bay Eye's figure, appearing beside Lusamin. Arm out. Catch Lusamin who is leaning back, and hold her in her arms. At the same time, the huge energy behind the dual wing beat crossbar, blocked Sableye's attack. Click. The sharp claw collided with the dual wing beat, and the huge force broke the ghost claw condensed by Sableye directly. However, Ye Bay Eye's energy dual wing beat was not affected in any way. Hurricane. The dual wing beat fanned, and the violent hurricane threatened to overturn the entire land. Sableye's body was slammed into the rock wall at the edge of the secret realm. Are you alright? After processing Sableye, Ye Bay Eye looked at Lusamin, and his eyes fell on Lusamin's bleeding left arm. You are hurt? Looking at the three wounds left on Lusamin's white and smooth jade arm, Ye Bay Eye felt a pang of heartache for something beautiful to be hurt, and after Lusamin saw Ye Bay Eye saved herself. The grievance in my heart could no longer be stopped, and I threw myself into his arms uncontrollably, crying. Strong soft feedback from the chest. Ye Bay I had no distractions in his heart. He stretched out his hand and patted Lou Summon's back lightly. At the same time, take out a bottle of super potion from the system backpack, and spray the potion on Lou Summon's wound. Tear off a piece of fabric from his body and wrap it around Lou Summon's wound. Done all this, Ye Bay I just had a leisurely look at Lou Summon. Long blonde hair behind her back, jewel like eyes shining like a starry sky exquisite facial features, a layer of light makeup, and delicate red lips, very attractive, further down, Lusamon is mainly dressed in white, supplemented by a close-fitting uniform with green lines, showing off her good figure to the fullest, injured contest condition, Lusamon, the charm does not decrease but increases, there is a sense of fragility that does not match her strong woman temperament, and people can't help but want to take care of her, can I still go, Ye Bay I tried to lift Lusamon up, Lusamon exerted strength on her ankle and wanted to stand up, but felt a sharp pain. A frown frowned on Lusamon's beautiful face. No, there is a sprain on the ankle. Enduring the sprain and running for a certain distance, the degree of the sprain was exacerbated. I didn't feel anything just now, but now seeing Ye Bay I, all the grievances in Lusamon's heart came out. Let me see. Gently supported Lusamon to sit on the ground again. Ye Bay I stretched out his hands and gently lifted Lusamon's trouser legs. 
eyes fell on Lucem and sprained ankle. The originally white, smooth and crystal clear ankles were now red, swollen and bulging. This injury is a bit serious, let me carry you and go. Let's go back to the villa first. Yi Bei looked at Lu Simon inquiringly. Um, hearing that Yi Bei I wants to hug herself, on Lu Simon's beautiful face, a rosy glow could not help but rise, fluffy red, very attractive. Put your left hand through the crook of Lu Simon's leg, and your right hand through Lu Simon's armpit. Arms up, Yi Bei I hugged Lu Simon horizontally. The dual wing beat can be seen behind the fan, and soon out of the secret place, exit the underworld, Yi Bei I flew in the air and went straight to Meli Mel Island. The villa of Lusaman's family, Yi Bei I, who does not take the usual way, enters the room directly from the window on the second floor, and this room happened to be the second bedroom where Yi Bei I slept in not long ago. As soon as he entered the room, Yi Bei I's delicate body became very stiff immediately, gently put Lusaman on the soft big bed, supporting Lusaman's back with one hand. He pulled the folded quilt over to give him support, under Lusaman's nervous gaze, Yi Bei I picked up the unused liquid medicine that had been placed on the bedside table before coming to the bed. Yi Bei I bent down and gently took off Lu Simon's shoes, looking at Lu Simon's white, smooth and translucent feet. Yi Bei I poured the medicine into the palm of his hand, then gently rubbed the red and swollen area. Careful gestures, gentle movements. It fell into Lu Simon's eyes and touched Lu Simon greatly. Yi Bei I, what did you want to do? While massaging the wound, Lu Simon asked about Yi Bei I's original plan. This, the image of Kai Yuram comes to mind. Yi Bei I revealed his original plan. I originally planned to challenge a powerful ice dragon later. As a result, I suddenly received a reminder that you were in danger, so I came here. Fortunately, you were fine. It turns out that I was in danger, and you were still notified. I asked why you showed up so promptly. Lusaman looked dazed. The rosiness on his face became more and more intense. It took more than ten minutes for Yi Bei I to let the medicine completely seep into Lusaman's swollen ankle. Just wanted to get up. As a result, he bumped into Lusaman head on. A faint body odor rushed into the nostrils. Lusaman hooked the back of Yi Bei I's head with both hands, and leaned forward. Mom, you, their eyes met, Yi Bei I's eyes widened in disbelief, after a long time, Lu Simon took a deep breath and looked at Yi Bei I with disappointment, Yi Bei I, do you dislike me, why do you say that, Yi Bei I was puzzled by the beauty just now, if you don't dislike me, why are you indifferent now, Lu Simon is obviously a questioning word, hearing it in Yi Bei I's ears, it was no less than an invitation to him, I see, at the same time, the first floor of the villa, Lily is sharing snacks with Bei I Gung Un, sudden, the Vulpix named Bei I Gung Un shook his ears, and looked in the direction of the ceiling with puzzled eyes. What's wrong with Bei I Gung Un? Is there something on it? Confused, Lily put down the ice cream in her hand. Prick up your ears and listen quietly. It seems that there is really a sound coming from above. Let's go and have a look. Talking room. Lily picked up Bei I Gung Un, moved her little feet trapped in two hollow white silk, stepped up the stairs and went straight to the building. Mother, are you back? Lily's curious voice spread throughout the corridor on the second floor and also reached the ears of Yi Bei I and Lu Simin. The sudden change made the two feel very nervous, especially Lu Simin. His complexion changed suddenly. After all, it was too late to regret now. Wait a minute, Yi Bei I. Lu Simin shouted to stop the interaction. At the same time, the footsteps outside the door got closer and closer, and finally stopped at the door. The room was extremely quiet. This moment, fingers intertwined. Lu Simon squeezed Yi Bei I's hands tightly with both hands. Yi Bei I could feel the sweat oozing from Lu Simon's palm and could also hear Lu Simon's extremely fast-beating heartbeat. Finally, the door opens, the footsteps gradually fade away. 4.4 Lily entered the master bedroom, after seeing the empty master bedroom, Lily showed such an expression. It must be Bei I Gun Gun, you heard it wrong. Did you hear me wrong? Bei I Gun Gun looked at the opposite door with puzzled eyes, just about to run over to reveal the truth. As a result, Lily hugged her. Okay, don't run around anymore, let's continue to eat snacks. Snacks and the truth, after thinking about it. Bei I Gung Un still chose delicious snacks, and was obediently carried away by Lily. Soon, the sound of footsteps on the second floor dissipated and fell into silence again. Cool. Lu Simon heaved a sigh of relief. The interaction continues. It is worth mentioning that the maturity of Lu Simon aroused Yu Bei I's competitive spirit, come up with an unprecedented good contest condition, go all out. And there is, although Lu Simon's ankle was sprained, her knee was not injured, so that both sides are very happy. In the end, Lu Simon fell into a coma. Yi Bei I also had fun, completely forgetting the original plan, watching Lu Simon peacefully falling asleep, appreciating the perfect sleeping face of the opponent, quietly waiting for Lu Simon to wake up and fight again. Dot. Chapter 94 Fight Lu Simon Again Noon Just when Yi Bei I felt a little hungry and wanted to get some food, suddenly, on Lu Simon's beautiful face, the long eyelashes blinked slightly, feeling like someone is watching you, Lu Simon soon fell into silence, it's just, the slightly intensified breathing 
and the gradual blush on her face betrayed her. Looking at Lu Suman's cute appearance, Yi Bei pretended to get up, unknowingly, Lu Suman secretly breathed a sigh of relief. It's not that she deliberately pretended to be asleep, Yi Bei is really too enthusiastic and devoted. It made her a little overwhelmed. What Lu Suman didn't expect was that Yi Bei seemed to get up, but turned around behind Lu Suman. Launch sucker punch from the rear. Yi Bei, you. Lu Suman widened her beautiful eyes in astonishment. I can't put it on anymore. Fed each other. Yi Bei took the tired Lu Suman into the underground world. This incident reminded Yi Bei, it's time to equip Lu Suman with some self defense safety measures. Best solution, naturally. It is for Lusaman to capture Pokemon for self-defense. The best is the flying system and superpower system. One can carry people flying, and the other can not only protect people well but also be very versatile. Underground Tunnel In order to make it easier for Lusaman to go back and forth between the underground world and the villa, Yi Bei is directly on the ground floor of Lusaman Villa, a secret base was established. Now, Lusaman changed into a tights with a star pattern. Show off your good figure perfectly. Why do we enter such a dangerous underground world? The very weak Lusaman holding Yi Bei's arms with both hands, catching Yi Bei to stabilize his figure, with a beautiful face. I look at my lover beside me in puzzlement. Of course I will take you to catch a Pokemon for self-defense. Yi Bei stretched out his hand, and lovingly scratched the tip of Lu Suman's nose. Thanks. Hearing that Yi Bei was worried about his safety, Lu Suman felt warm inside. The beautiful eyes are narrowed, and the delicate facial features are filled with a happy smile. Head fully nestled on Yi Bei's shoulder. A faint scent of body fragrance is introduced into the tip of Yi Bei's nose. Let's fly there on Dragonite. Talking room. Yi Bei released Dragonite, with Lu Suman in front, ride Dragonite to the nearest secret place. During the period, Yi Bei expressed his thoughts and asked Lu Suman's own opinion. Do you have any other attribute Pokemon that you want to tame? Let's think about it. Is the melodic of the water system possible? As Rebecca's woman, if Lu Suman has a Pokemon that he wants to tame from the bottom of his heart, melodic known as the most beautiful Pokemon, is definitely a choice not to be missed. Melotic. The corner of Yi Bei's mouth twitched. Although it is said that Annabelle defeated the Four Island Kahuna of the Alola region, which is equivalent to the Elite Four of other regions, keep the level of Pokemon in the Alola underground secret realm at a height of 70. In theory, Melotic is easy to find. But in fact, Melotic is extremely rare even in secret realms. Not all water system secret realms can see Melotic figure. Look around later, but you'd better not get your hopes up. At the same time, Question mark you have entered the flame secret realm? Due to the Alola region, most of the rifts are still unexplored. Yi Bei could only grip one by one. Search the whole secret place. Yi Bei and Lu Suman encountered a flock of arrow sparrows on the way. Arrow sparrow fire flying. The main body of the appearance is mainly red. The tail ends of the dual wing beat on both sides are black. The main body of the tail is black, with V-shaped yellow stripes printed on it, and grey feathers under the body. Adult sparrow finch is 1.2 meters tall. It can do man flying, and the fire type makes the back of the hunting arrow very warm, very suitable for man flying, but there is one thing, the sparrow is not very good, very aggressive and carnivorous. Favorite targets are bird Pokemon such as Wingull and Pikapek. When we first met, this group of arrow sparrows was so bold that they surrounded Yi Bei and Lu Suman, completely fearless of Dragonite, certainly, their fate is also very tragic. Thunderbolt, Dragonite incarnates as the king of thunder and lightning to teach how to make a bird. Although Dragonite's special attack is not as good as physical attack, it does not mean that it is not strong. 100's special attack species strength, still tall compared to most Pokemon. What's more, Yi Bei's Dragonite has master level strength, but the group of arrow sparrows in front of them are just newcomers to the elite level. After the Flamingo was defeated, Yi Bei quickly took Lusaman to the next secret place. The second secret realm is a flying secret realm. To Yi Bei's surprise, he and Lusaman actually met a Salamence in this secret place. Purple Gifted Salamence. Salamence has two big blood red dual wing beat, and a wide back. It can almost be selected as the most suitable Pokemon for man flying. But one thing is also bad, as its name suggests, the Salamence dragon is very violent. Not only is its aggressiveness far superior to that of the Arrow Sparrow, but it will also go up and destroy everything around it uncontrollably. Salamence of Mega Evolution is even more violent, even Breeder and his trainer will attack, if it is Yi Bei himself, with a blessing of soaring in the sky. He can completely subdue Salamence, definitely go for Salamence. But Lu Suman's words are not suitable. However, Yi Bei I still tame this Salamence, it would be a good to give it to Gladian. Gladian with Silverly will surely be able to suppress this Salamence. As Gladian's strength increased, it also enhanced the security environment for Lu Suman and Lulian a disguised form. Then there is, although Yi Bei also wants to subdue Salamence, but like Tyranita, Yi Bei's idea is rather lack than excess. I'd better wait for the free time and come to the show flash again. After throwing an ultra ball to subdue Salamence, 
Yi Bei took Lu Sum into the next secret place. It is still a flying type secret realm. But this time, the Pokemon Yi Bei I encountered finally satisfied him and Lu Sum at the same time. Dragonite, compared with Salamence, Dragonite's personality can't be said to be easy to get along with. It can only be said that it is very easy to get along with. Not only has a gentle personality, but also a kind heart, and likes to rescue people who are drowning in the sea. But one thing, when encountering Kingdra, Dragonite will still fall into rage. Anyway, Yi Bei I is Dragonite, met Ms. Kingdra but didn't show that kind of crazy contest condition. It can only be said that dragons and dragons cannot be generalized. The huge Dragonite, whose life is dying, has long since lost the racial habits of the Dragonite family. But this point, Yi Bei I still told Lu Sumin, keep her on the lookout for Dragonite meeting Kingdra. And there is, this is still a green female Dragonite. It's useless Yi Bei I looking for. This heterochromatic female Dragonite, after seeing the Dragonite under Yi Bei I again, flew out from the forest with bright A's, flying all the way to the Dragonite, showing a girl-like expression to Yi Bei I's surprise. After seeing the little green female dragon again, the huge Dragonite actually showed a swaying gesture, showing Yi Bei I amused past the Ultra Ball to Lu Sumin. Yi Bei I stared at the nervous Lu Sumin, and tremblingly threw the Ultra Ball. Snapped, the Ultra Ball draws an oblique arc in the air perfectly missed the heterochromatic dragonite. In the end, it was the heterochromatic dragonite who took the initiative to chase after the falling ultra ball, bumped into the ultra ball, and completed the capture. Dragonite's body descends rapidly flying, Yi Bei I caught the ultra ball smoothly and handed it to Lu Sumin. Apostrophe question mark thank you, Yi Bei I, excitedly holding the ultra ball filled with different colored dragonite in the palm of your hand. After looking at it for a while, wearing tights, Lu Sumin, who didn't have any pockets, had to hand over the poke ball to Yi Bei I for safekeeping. After returning to the villa, I will hand it over to her. Wait until Yi Bei I puts the poke ball away. Immediately, Lu Summon stretched out her white arms impatiently, wrapping them around the back of Yi Bei I's neck, leaning forward, why and squeezed Yi Bei I's chest. The strong body fragrance rushes into Yi Bei I's nasal cavity. The two kiss passionately, let Yi Bei I feel that there is no wrong payment to worry about, and everything is worth it. Dot. Chapter 95 Two different colors. Lusamin's blissful troubles. Ahem. Almost suffocated, Lusamin rolled her eyes. Yi Bei I, thanks to her lack of confidence before, unexpectedly, Yi Bei I's enthusiasm far exceeded her initial expectations. Come out, Dragonite. Ignored Lusamin's hypocritical dislike, Yi Bei I released Green Dragonite. Do you want to get close to her and get to know each other well? Okay. Lusamin's eyes brightened, but how do I get there? Of course I'll take you there. Yi Bei I's words fell, and the energy behind the dual wing beat emerged. Put your hands under Lusamon's armpit on both sides, encircling Lusamon's waist. Lift up his whole body, come to the back of the green dragonite. Wait until Lusamon grabs the dragonite with both hands. Yi Bei I let go, back behind the giant dragonite. Let's go, let's look for the superpower secret realm, and the water system secret realm. Out of flying rift. The two dragonites, one behind the other, are moving towards the next situation. Lusamon is very happy to ride her Pokemon flying. Question mark you have entered the water rock secret realm? It seems that your luck is not bad. The giant dragonite slows down slowly, equal to the heterochromatic dragonite. Let's look for it quickly. Lusamon was very excited and very girlish. Not long after, the two searched all over the secret realm. Yi Bei I saw a Phoebus on the edge of the lake. Lusamon also took a look, but failed to recognize Phoebus as a melodic cub. Fly to the distance with green dragonite, and Yi Bei I stopped. After flying for a while, he found that Yi Bei I didn't keep up, and Lu Sumin, who felt strange, directed Green Dragonite to return. What's wrong? The melodic you were looking for. Found it. Looking at the beautiful face, the red lips are lightly parted. Lu Sumin with doubts on his face. A mysterious smile appeared on Yi Bei I's face. Really? Where? Lu Sumin widened her eyes excitedly. The beautiful eyes are constantly patrolling around, but except for one Phoebus, where is the figure of Melotic around? Finally, the eyes returned to Yi Bei I. Where is it? Why did you lie to me? If it is not now separated from Yi Bei I behind the two dragonites, Lu Sumin will definitely make a move. Teach Yi Bei I a good lesson and let him know what will happen if he teases himself. I kid you not, isn't this melodic? Yi Bei I pointed to the edge of the shoal below, as if Phoebus had passed out. R? Are you serious? Lu Sumin seemed to have heard the big joke, and a trace of astonishment flashed across King Ching's face. Or, does Phoebus evolve into melodic? Bingo. Yi Bei I smiled. Question mark Phoebus. Water? Question mark ability. Slow? Talent purple question mark level 70 although this fever's ability is not free and easy and after evolution the slow ability may not change into aggressive but with ability ointment yi bei is fearless furthermore lusamin likes melotic and she doesn't want to expect her to fight for her talent and ability are actually not that important unbelievable lusamin opened her mouth in surprise her delicate red lips turned into a no if i didn't know yi bei i well 
Lusaman could hardly believe this could be true. Serena has a different color melotic, which also evolved into a melotic from the Fever's stage using prism scale. Prism scale? So it's like... Like Kingdra. Lusaman subconsciously sighed. However, these words made the different colored Dragonite below him a little dissatisfied. Kui Long Tilda. Out of Yi Bei Ai's expectation. The huge Dragonite, which should have no reaction to this, unexpectedly showed the same expression of hatred, rage's grip on Dragon Claw. This abnormal behavior caught Yi Bei Ai's attention. After noticing the sight of the huge Dragonite, and continuously drifting towards the green Dragonite, doubts cleared, Yi Bei Ai was amused, and now it's a real hammer, the giant Dragonite is a chromatic dragon. And as Yi Bei Ai reminded earlier, Lu Simin, who has a bad relationship with the Dragonite family and the Kingdra family, soon I realized I was wrong, hastily reached out and rubbed Green Dragonite's tap. Sorry Dragonite. Kui Long, being appeased, Green Dragonite quickly dissipated, and this scene, falling into the eyes of the giant Dragonite, Dragonite showed a thoughtful expression, under the gaze of Yi Bei Ai and Lu Simin. The huge Dragonite took the initiative to fly in front of the Green Dragonite, stretched out the Dragon Claw, touched Green Dragonite's head imitating Lu Simin. Looking at the huge Dragonite with strong limbs and a majestic figure at first glance, feeling the strong high decky breath coming from the huge Dragonite body, Green Dragonite narrowed his eyes instantly, showing the expression of a Fang Earl, and took the initiative to lean forward, rubbing his head with the huge Dragonite, sticking to it. We dot 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 are actually loved by two long Xiu. Yi Bei Ai stared at Lu Simin in astonishment. He met Lu Simin head on with the same astonished expression. A moment later, seeing that the two dragons are not conscious at all, putting the two of them aside completely, Yi Bei Ai coughed. The huge dragonite just woke up like a dream, leaving from the gentle village. He looked back at Yi Bei Ai in embarrassment. At the same time, Lu Simin directs Green Dragonite to use Thunder Punch. The dragon claw wrapped in thunder light fell from the sky, slapped the stinky fish and slapped it flying instantly to kill it. Go. Lu Simon throws a dive ball thrown to her by Yi Bei Ai to complete the capture. Successfully conquered again. In particular, the Pokemon I have taken in is the Milotic Cub that I have been thinking about. The smile on Lu Simon's face could hardly be concealed. Yi Bei Ai, kiss me quickly, let me see if I'm dreaming. Lu Simon smirked and said amazing words. For this requirement, of course Yi Bei Ai agreed. It wasn't until Lu Simon felt that he was about to suffocate that Yi Bei Ai returned to the back of the huge Dragonite. Zero dot 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 asking for flowers, saved. But it was indeed true. Lu Simon confirmed that everything in front of her eyes is real. At the same time, the two continued on their final journey. After about half an hour, Yi Bei Ai and Lu Simon finally found their favorite superpower secret realm. Yi Bei Ai, Psychic Pokemon. Do you have any good recommendations? Compared with other attribute Pokemon, the appearance of Psychic Pokemon is often very cute. Looking at the various Pokemon below, Lusaman was a little dazed for a moment. Which style do you want? Yi Bei Ai asked. The brain was running fast, thinking of Lily's whiteness. Lusaman blurted out. Is there any super type Pokemon that looks similar to Bei Ai Gungan? A glimmer of expectation flashed across Lusaman's beautiful face. Bei Ai Gugo? Lily's Bei Ai Gungan Yi Bei Ai has seen it before, but it just looks like that super power Pokemon. Yi Bei Ai fell into deep thought. Zero. The figures of super power Pokemon flashed in my mind, suddenly. Thinking of a Pokemon with a ruby embedded in its head, a purple fluffy body, and a noble and elegant shape. Brighten up. Yes, Espeon, Espeon, Espeon's noble and elegant look came to mind, and Lusaman's eyes lit up. Very well, then it is decided that Espeon, it's great to be able to have a companion with Bei Ai Gungan in daily life. Lusaman rubbed her hands excitedly. With the goal, the speed of finding Pokemon has been greatly improved. Soon, Yi Bei Ai and Lusaman were on a piece of grass at the same time and saw a data panel. Question mark as peon, psychic, question mark ability, telepathy, talent, orange, question mark special ability, skill mastery, psycho boost, question mark. Deoxys exclusive move, psycho boost, Deoxys, are you polite? I was wondering. The panel is out, where is the Pokemon? Now seeing that this as peon is a different color, Yi Bei Ai finally knows where as peon is, it was on the lawn. But at a glance, they couldn't see each other. Encounter two Pokemon of different colors in a row. Yi Bei Ai had to admit that Lu Simin was lucky. This is the color. A little too fashionable. Perhaps only Lu Simin, a beauty who likes to wear grass and green line clothes, can control it. Witnessing Lu Simin directing Dragonite to defeat Espeon to complete the conquest, ZT, Lu Simin can be regarded as having a strong guard force around him. Yi Bei Ai sent Lu Simin back to the villa. Soon, Lu Simin's happy troubles come. Yi Bei Ai is so powerful, it seems to have infinite energy. On the first floor, Bei Ai Gungan raised his head and looked in the direction of the second floor in doubt. The strange voice appeared again. But, having learned from the past, glancing at Lily who was doing the question, Bei Ai Gungan quickly looked away. Dot. Chapter 96 Conquest Battle The Three Dragons of the Way, Kyurum Afternoon, Lusamin fell into a deep sleep with exhaustion all over her body. Yi Bei Ai left the villa, 
He finally remembered what was going on. Through teleportation, go to the Unover region Ice Dragon Mystery. As the head of the three dragons of the Tau, Kyurum must be subdued. After all Kyurum could have devoured the sun and moon gods to Necrozma, devouring Zekrom and Reshiram representing yin and yang, the achievement that can be achieved in the future is likely to be the first person under Asuis, Yi Bei is looking forward to it, if you subdue Kyurum and fuse yin and yang at the same time that has never appeared in the game, what kind of powerful and complete Kyurum will you get? The north wind blows, the frost bites, once entering the ice dragon mystery, Yi Bei directly summoned black Rayquaza, Groudon, Lunala, Three first level beasts. Normals Rayquaza Flying Dragon. Ability is an airlock. It is four times restrained by ice. But after Yi Bei Eyes Rayquaza grasped the authority of the law, even without Mega Evolution, ability has been changed to Delta Airflow. Weakness of Flying System disappeared. Currently only Dragon Type is double restrained by ice and Dragon Types. Same. Rayquaza's Dragon Type also restrained Kyurum 783. Both sides have advantages and disadvantages. As for Groudon. Although ground type is restrained by ice type, but after primal reversion, ground attribute changed to ground fire, will no longer be restrained by ice. Lunala serves as a support position, and is responsible for protecting Yi Bei while participating in the battle. Although the two mythical beasts are behind Kyurum in level, but the existence of law and authority, it is enough to make up this gap, and even overtake it. After the preliminary preparations were completed, Yi Bei quickly scanned the entire ice dragon secret realm. Find the whereabouts of Kyurum, at the same time, However, Kyurum also noticed three powerful auras coming, and he woke up from a deep sleep. Huge mountain-like body, drilled out from under the ice and snow, as the height rises, numerous ice crystals, frost and snow are affected by gravity, slide down. Groudon, use your power of the earth to build a core in the sky. Now that you have mastered the corresponding legal authority, naturally, you must learn to use the rules to fight. It's just that Yi Bei obviously overestimated Groudon's IQ. Groudon, Earth's core? What's that? Can it be eaten? I don't understand what Yi Bei is talking about at all. Groudon didn't know, so he opened his mouth, and a lot of flames spit up from his mouth. The pillar of fire with a diameter of hundreds of meters turned the Ice Dragon secret realm into a sea of flames in an instant. Roar. The Ice Dragon's huge mouth opened, and a large amount of frost breath spit up from the mouth, and the extremely low temperature cold air spread rapidly. The extremely cold low temperature meets the scorching flame. The imagined picture of a large amount of white mist generation did not appear. Frost freezes even the blazing fire, and without hesitation, they attacked Yu Bei. Rayquaza, absorb attacks with black holes. Rayquaza roared, dragon claw shook slightly, located in the center of the battlefield, a black hole tens of meters in size quietly emerged, absorbing and devouring all the frost and flames. If Yu Bei and Rayquaza want to, it is also possible to suck Kyurum into a black hole. It's just that Yi Bei's purpose is not to kill Kyurum, but to subdue him. Stabilize the situation for now. Yi Bei looked at Groudon, thinking that Groudon probably didn't know what the core of the earth represented. I believe that Groudon must have seen Yi Bei in the core of the earth. It can only be described in more detail. Groudon, think about the geological structure with the highest mass and strongest gravitational force that you have encountered while sleeping underground. That is the core of the earth. Groudon showed a thoughtful expression. Half an hour, nodding. Seeing Groudon nodding. Yi Bei heaved a sigh of relief. Fine, Groudon's brain is not idle. Now I want you to create a small core in the air, and increase the gravity to the maximum, and only for Kyurum, can you do it? As soon as Yi Bei's words came out, Groudon's eyes lit up and he roared excitedly. Roar. Although the momentum is full and the performance is very exciting. But for some reason, Groudon's excitement always gave Yi Bei the feeling that he wanted something bad. The next scene verified what Yi Bei thought in his heart. Primal Groudon explained with his life what it means not to fight for three days but to go to the house to expose the tiles. In the void, a small earth core composed of earth energy emerged, exuding astonishingly high temperature and gravitational force. However, it is not as Groudon promised. Gravity is only for Kyurum. The strong gravitational force of the earth's core also covers Mega Black Rayquaza. Caught off guard. The two behemoths were absorbed by the miniature core without any resistance. Seeing this scene, Primal Groudon first looked back at Yi Bei in surprise. Give Yi Bei a look of approval. This trick works. Immediately. Primal Groudon was so excited that he couldn't wait to release his exclusive trick, Precipice Blades. Groudon, this time I'll see where you go Caterpie. Die. Groudon growled. The rich earth power spread out, covering the entire secret realm, turning the secret realm into a piece of blood red. This scene made Yi Bei shake his head. You really deserve a beating. I won't stop you later. As Yi Bei expected, spiky Precipice Blades popped out of the ground and blew it out. Yes, at the moment when Primal Groudon was full of joy thinking that he had turned himself into a master, and tried to betray Rayquaza, 
Rayquaza directly used the power of soaring in the sky to build a miniature black hole inside the core of the Earth built by Groudon. Crush Groudon's condensed miniature core, Rayquaza and Kyurem were also freed from the shackles of gravity. At the same time, Dragon Ascent, the body is covered with terrifying flying energy, and a terrifying aura emanates from Rayquaza, the pressure made Primal Groudon subconsciously shake his body. This Caterpie is not here to beat him, is it? The answer is obvious, with Rayquaza's character of vengeance, Groudon took the full blow from Mega Rayquaza, Mega Rayquaza knocked Primal Groudon's body thousands of meters away. Groudon's tens of thousands of tons of body left a wide and deep ravine thousands of meters long on the ground. A large amount of magma poured into it. A peculiar landscape is formed in the Ice Dragon Secret Realm. A straight river of lava produced. The ice and snow along the way were melted by the high temperature, converging towards the river, breeding the great white smoke. After one hit, Primal Groudon's body was firmly embedded in the rock wall on the edge of the Secret Realm. The left shoulder hit by the attack lost consciousness instantly. Groudon's tragic situation. Yibei I shook his head. Why did you say you provoked him? In soaring in the sky, Luna Lazagile eyes revealed a hint of astonishment. She glanced at Primal Groudon and Black Mega Rayquaza. She was stunned. Are all the Pokemon under Yibei so vicious? Be a teammate if you don't agree with each other. What about her? Thinking about the strength shown by Rayquaza and Groudon, Luna La shivered. In an instant, he changed from floating in front of Yibei to hiding behind Yibei. Yibei. Fortunately Rayquaza is absolutely loyal to Yibei, if Groudon has the upper hand, as far as Lunala's performance is concerned, I'm afraid it's not reliable at all. Rayquaza, Dragon Dance, Lunala, Phantom Force, Groudon, if not dead, Rock Tomb. Three orders came out from Yibei one after another, Yibei intends to change tactics, let Rayquaza be the only main attacker, Lunala and Groudon play support, Rayquaza's body flew high into the sky, hovering in the clouds, and mysterious power emerged, covering Rayquaza, increasing its strength and speed. Below, the void below Lunala suddenly opened a portal exuding the aura of ghosts, and sneaked into it like a dungeon. Located behind Kyurem, a similar portal emerged, and Lunala, who had just dived into it, drilled out again. The dual wing beat that is attached to the ghost energy is discharged with force, driving the strong wind knock off Kyurem. The blow with the power of tens of thousands of tons instantly staggered Kyurem, almost falling into the mud. The ice beam attack converging in the mouth was also interrupted. At the same time, Groudon who regained consciousness shook his body, lock on Kyurem's position, before Kyurem could stand still. There were 3.6 huge rocks condensed on the top of the head, which gave Kyurem a mess. Kyurem wants to fight back, but after Groudon was taught a lesson, he had already lost the opportunity to resist. A miniature cow floated above Kyurem's head. Hold it firmly, Kyurem wants struggle, but Groudon is pumping out the power of the law to counteract Kyurem's resistance. While the two mythical beasts were at a stalemate with each other, Ariel Rayquaza has harnessed the power of Dragon Dance to the limit. Kyurem never dreamed. One day I was lucky enough to see Rayquaza fighting alongside Groudon. It can only be said that the defeat was not wronged. Facing Rayquaza's all-out outrage, the miniature Earth Core was crushed by the violent dragon energy. Kyurem's body was also shot tens of thousands of meters away. The body slammed into the wall on the other side of the Secret Realm, and fell deeply into it. The violent shockwave plunged the entire ground of the Secret Realm into a turmoil. Yibei's figure flashed. Then through the wind, snow and severe cold, flew to the end of the secret realm. Take out an Ultra Ball associated with the Flying Rift, aim at Kyurem and throw it. Go, Ultra Ball. Chapter 97 Level Up. Short Hair Serena. Question mark. Congratulations to the host for conquering Kyurem. The special secret realm Ice Dragon Secret Realm is unlocked, and it can now be associated with Pokeball. With the success of Yibei's subjugation, add one more to the secret realm held by Yibei. At the same time, the common ice-type Pokémon in the Ice Dragon Secret Realm are evenly distributed among other ice-type secret realms. In other words, the Ice Dragon Secret Realm at this moment is just like the Flying Sky Secret Realm before. Not a single wild Pokémon exists inside. Yibei I will Kyurem's Pokéball, changed from Flying Rift to Ice Dragon Rift. Take out three bottles of full restore at the same time. Give Rayquaza, Groudon, and Lunala respectively. Help the three mythical beasts restore lost stamina. This action won unanimous praise from the three divine beasts, especially Groudon. Originally in his mind, although Yibei is not as annoying as Rayquaza, he is also very annoying. After all, Yibei subdued Rayquaza first, and then him. From Groudon's point of view, he was coerced by force to join Yibei's command. But now, having experienced Yibei's excellent command and mastered the real way of using the power of the earth, coupled with Yibei's attitude towards him, let Groudon thoroughly approve Yibei, certainly, Rayquaza is still annoying despite having a side-by-side -side experience. Come out, Kyurem. I don't know that my actions have been completely approved by Groudon, 
Yi Bei picked up the Ultra Ball that fell on the ground and released it again. Kaiurum's huge body fell to the ground. Take another bottle of full restore and pour it into Kaiurum's mouth. With the power of the medicine filling Kaiurum's mouth and gradually spreading throughout the body, Kaiurum's body began to heal quickly. The huge dragon eyes opened, and they saw Yi Bei who was closer to him. Kaiurum's dragon's mouth opened, and a burst of ice blue's extremely cold energy quickly condensed. Taking precautions, Yi Bei quickly pulled back and retreated to the protection range of the three gods and beasts. At the same time, the three divine beasts concentrated their attacks again. Kaiurum did not evade. The two sides fought again. After repeating this more than ten times, Kaiurum finally recognized the identity of Yi Bei trainer. Period. The continuous battles have caused the levels of the three beasts to rise to varying degrees, except for Kaiurum, who is the highest level. Rayquaza 160, Groudon 159, Yala 145. In, Rayquaza and Groudon were originally at the same level, but there is now a level gap. After querying the system, Yibei I learned that, in addition to the basic combat experience gains brought by talents, the perception of Pokemon itself will also affect the gain of experience. The higher the understanding, the faster you grow in battle the higher your battle experience will be. In short, Rayquaza's IQ crushes Groudon's. The continuous battles and level upgrades gave Bei a taste of the sweetness. Just leave Rayquaza, Groudon, Lunala, all here. Let the four divine beasts learn from each other and progress in battle. At the same time, Invited Target enters the underground world. Invited Target Serena enters the underground world. Two reminders came into Yi Bei's mind one after another. M and Serena, thinking about it, it has been more than a day since he saw the two women. Yi Bei I decided to meet the two women. Outside, quality. Annabelle quit the underground world, she is going to contact other Interpol. As a result, I ran into the Zinnia infestation as soon as I went out. Hope to join Interpol. Although Zinnia made no demands, but Annabelle was well aware of the other party's little thought. I wanted to refuse directly. But thinking of the possible results of letting the other party who owns Salamans go, and trying to achieve his goal by himself. And after storage correctly guide the other party to the right path and bring about changes. Annabelle agreed to Zinnia's request. Let it become a temporary operator. Kanda region, underground world, through the small map, Yi Bei quickly found Serena and Mu who had just entered the underground world. Today's two girls are both very beautifully dressed. Miss still combing two big buns, with a white visor on her head, her delicate facial features are white and rosy, wearing a set of durham and blue and white short sleeves on the upper body. The chest is still bulging, as if to burst the clothes. The lower body is a short olivian colored skirt, and the bottom is one piece black silk. The whole person looks full of vitality and charm at the same time. And then Serena, she still has a perfect face, golden ratio facial features, and a head of gold hair that has been cut into shoulder length short hair that hangs freely, adding a bit of mature charm to it. Today Sam I put on a light pink skirt, the skirt is divided into two parts, the middle is cut off by a section of black lining, forming a strong visual impact. The lining is located below the breasts that have begun to take shape and the waist is upwards, with a width of about 10 centimeters. Down is a light pink skirt, extending down to the bend of the legs. Passing by an absolute vacuum of snow-white fields, further down are Serena's slender legs wrapped in black silk, and black boots with pink stripes. Serena with short hair immediately surprised you Bei. Question mark Serena, why did you cut your hair? Be amazed by Serena's beauty for a while. After reacting, Yi Bei showed doubts, because I'm going to be an adult soon. Seeing Yi Bei, Serena looked very happy and threw herself into Yi Bei's arms. The two bumped into each other. Yi Bei wrapped his hands around Serena's waist, spun around, and at the same time released the strength. It's like waltzing with Wang Hao, Serena. After landing, Serena began to explain. Just when Yi Bei left, Saki contacts Serena and tells her she's coming of age. In two days, get her ready. Return to Carlos to claim the old Dervish Pokemon. Originally encountered this situation, Serena must have to fly directly back to Carlos. But because of the existence of the underground world, knowing that she could go to Carlos at any time, Serena was not in a hurry to go back. Instead, I planned to meet Ebei first. As a result, who knew what would happen? For more than a day, I didn't see Ebei Jang. Brother Ebei, where have you been? The blushing Serena looked curiously at Ebei, as for why she blushed. Of course it was because she could do shameful things as an adult. Two more days. Serena didn't know how long she had waited for this day, and she was not excited. Dot. Chapter 98 Semi Fantasy Time Mega Evolution Stone See Yi Bei separate from Serena, Molso stepped forward and hugged Yi Bei. It's been a while, Yi Bei, what did you do in Alola? Due to the lack of information in the Alola region, the lack of media, and the lack of contact with the outside world, so much so that Lucas the Great God shines during Alola, although people all over the world feel a very strong light coming to this world, 
but it seems that few humans other than Alola know what happened there. Let's talk as we go. Yibei I reached the underground of Sinar region through the teleportation machine. Tell the two girls what happened in Alola region about Necrozma, and the reason to go to the Sin underground secret realm is to level up. Wanting to challenge Giovanni, who guarantees at least a master, if you remove the mythical beasts, the lineup that Yibei I can get now is only Dragonite and Genesect. Two days, Yibei I intends to improve the strength of his Pokemon. Other candidates for the war, Yibei I already had a rough idea in mind. In this battle, as Earl Dervish's partner, Ninja Frog will definitely occupy a spot. Furthermore, Considering that Giovanni owns a trump card Beedrill, Yibei's different colored Beedrill also occupies a place. Finally Mutuo's rival, considering that Mutuo lost to Kyogre, in contrast, the level should be far inferior to that of Rakers a writing Groudon, not even as good as Lunala, not to mention Ice Dragons, combined with theatrical version 16, Genesect became the best candidate, everything seems to be destined. Top priority, what Yibei has to do is to improve the strength of the above three Pokemon. At the same time, Yibei I told the two girls everything that happened during this period, Ruzami 317 AI is also mentioned, however, only part of the content. Wow, so there are parallel worlds in this world? Another world. It feels so cool. Listening to the thrilling and exciting stories told by Yibei I, the two women felt extremely devastated for not being able to go together. What's more, listening to Yibei I's description, Alola region has sun and beaches, and even held a Courtney party. Imagine doing shy things with Yibei I on the beach, that feeling. On the beautiful faces of and Serena, a red glow rose at the same time, especially Serena who has not experienced the actual experience, as delicate as a Barbie doll, she subconsciously stretched out her tongue to lick her pink lips and swallowed. Brother Yibei I, next time there is such a good thing, you must remember to bring me with you. In Yibei I's mind, all kinds of images that he experienced in the Lusamin villa before appeared in an instant. In the picture, Lusamin looks mature, gradually replaced by Serena, who is full of youthful vigor and light body. With Serena's weight, even if she hugs her, she won't weigh too much, even standing. Cough cough. I can't think about it anymore. This kind of thing should be put in two days later, when Serena receives the nominal Earl Dervish partner. Next, Yibei I searched for a secret realm for leveling. Among them, the leveling location of Greninja and Genesect is undoubtedly Sinnoh. In the current underground world, the highest level is Sinnoh, and there is no other better choice. As for Beedrill, his current level can't catch up with the two, it can only be carried by Yibei I, Adpf because he will try to leapfrog to various secret realms. M and Serena also separated, looking for a suitable secret realm for leveling. At the same time, with my heart attached to my hometown, I immediately returned to Lorelei in the Orange Islands. Just commanded the Pokemon with super attribute under his command and completed a lot of post-disaster reconstruction work. Today's Lorelei has her hair tied up and is wearing a professional olive attire. Her upper body is covered with a light red tube top covering half of her stalwart. Her lower body is a black hip wrapping skirt and her two round legs wrapped in black silk are standing on black's long high-heeled shoes. At the end of the day's work, Lorelei dragged his exhausted body back to his villa in the Orange Islands. As an elite four, the quality of Lorelei's villas is undeniable. Even this major flood event failed to destroy the exterior walls and special glass of the villa. Enter the gate, and no imaginary maid came to meet. Instead, a dry and rotten breath rushes into the nostrils, because there are properties in multiple regions. But Lorelei doesn't often travel to and from various properties usually live in Indigo Plateau, therefore, there are no servants on the other estates, except the Indigo Plateau. Stretching out white hands to support the shoe cabinet, stabilizing the figure, Lorelei's right leg wrapped in black silk is bent upwards. He took off his high heels, put on the slippers in the shoe cabinet, and entered the living room. Knowing that her super type Pokemon have been exhausted for a day, she doesn't want to disturb the rest of the Pokemon. I had no choice but to come to the windows one by one in person and open the windows. The sea breeze blew and poured into the room bringing a lot of salty and humid atmosphere, but it also drove away the rotten air in the house. Done these, Lorelei came to the sofa made entirely of leather, with her buttocks wrapped in the black hip wrapping skirt, she sat down on her buttocks, completely sinking into it. Tilting his head back, Lorelei's thinking began to diverge. Suddenly, as if remembering something, Lorelei's eyes lit up. Underground world? Invited target Lorelei entered the underground world. Underneath the Sinar region, a reminder from the system sounded in Yibei's ears. Turning his eyes away, Beedrill who always needs to obey the command, Yibei finally decided not to meet Lorelei for the time being, let her study it slowly by herself. At the same time, entering the underground world, Lorelei, like the previous women, showed various emotions towards the underground world. At the same time, under the introduction of the system, you can get started quickly and start digging. Not long after, props were freshly released one by one, and then quickly disappeared in front of Lorelei. Question mark Finn Fossil, Amora? Question mark Mega Evolution Stone. B drill, fossil bird X fossil sea beast, 
Lower sea beast, question mark fossil fish x fossil sea beast, gill fish sea beast, several reminders in succession, now if Yi Bei doesn't want to see Lorelei, he has to, after all, the props dug out by Lorelei are really too strong, especially the mega evolution stone, in the case of the slow progress of the mega B drill level, it is a timely help, it turns out that you invited me, after seeing Yi Bei, most of the doubts in Lorelei's mind were resolved, that's right, I invited Lorelei elite, facing Lorelei's weirdness, with a hint of hesitant expression. Yi Bei I smiled. In fact, in addition to Laurel Elite, I also invited Annabelle Detective, Cynthia Champion and others. It turned out to be like this. Hearing Yi Bei I's explanation, Laurel I suddenly felt embarrassed. She thought Yi Bei I was interested in her. Think about all these years, in the face of an endless stream of suitors, all refused the contest condition, so much so that I became an older leftover woman. Laurel I wanted to say, I am willing to make a three chapter contract with Yi Bei I, and have a temporary relationship for a month after the one-month trial period expires, according to the satisfaction of both parties, decide whether to renew the contract together, result, it's embarrassing that Yi Bei I didn't invite himself alone to enter such a magical world, but, the existence of tunnel treasures and secret realms still gave Lorelei a great surprise, here, she seemed to see the hope of defeating Bruno and hitting the championship, Canto Elite 4, the reason why there are no champions is entirely because the restrained relationship has formed a cycle, Lorelei, who specializes in ice type, has the strongest quadruple restrained Yulongdu, but he can't beat Bruno and Agatha. But Yulongdu defeated the other two, but stumbled against the weakest Lorelei, just very depressed. It can be said that if Lorelei does not retreat, it is impossible for Yulongdu to become the champion. And Lorelei himself was unable to improve his strength because he lacked enough rivals. It is difficult to hit the championship in a short time. In addition, there are more and more incidents of persecution by natural disasters and evil organizations in my hometown. So much so that Lorelei has faint thoughts of retiring. And now, all these thoughts disappeared, and Lorelei was confident of hitting the championship. Although it is said that all the essence of the underground world should belong to Yi Bei, but Yi Bei still explained that there is a question about the ownership of the Mega Evolution Stone. For this, Lorelei opened up and said that she has no objections at all and is very grateful to Yi Bei for inviting her into the underground world. Some conversation. In Lorelei's gratitude, Yi Bei handed over three groups of fossils to Kedai. Have to say, Lorelei's luck is really good, the Pokemon resurrected from these three groups of fossils, all are beings with ice type, explained by Yi Bei. After getting the fossils and hearing that the underground world has the function of teleportation, Kefu left in a hurry. Go to Dasha Valley to revive the fossil. At the same time, Yi Bei continued to return to leveling contest condition. Two days later, Mo accompanied Serena back to Carlos, go pick up Earl Dervish mates and meet Sage for a dinner party tonight. At dusk, the sun goes down, the sky, it gets dark, the Viking Jim welcomes a male challenger. Enter the Viking Jim, under the light, his shadow stretched very long, and there seemed to be two scarlet eyes flickering inside. Dot. Chapter 99 Viridian Jim Yi Bei vs. Giovanni Walking through a long tunnel full of surveillance, under the guidance of the road signs, Yi Bei came to the battle site of the Viking Gymnasium. In the large battlefield, rows of lights suddenly lit up. Giovanni is already waiting on the stage of the gym group. Secretary Maitre points to the referee flag, standing on the high platform where the referee stands. The two seem to have known about his arrival. We meet again, Yi Bei. Unexpectedly, you have already collected seven badges so quickly. Across the battlefield, Giovanni greeted Yi Bei. I'm simply lucky, it's not worth mentioning. Stepping forward, he came to the stage of the challenger side. Facing Giovanni across the air, Yi Bei smiled slightly, talking nonsense. But there is no tension in the face of the evil boss. He even had the leisure to cast a glance at the secretary's any hour in the referee's seat. In my heart, I silently compared the real bird with Lusamin, Cynthia, M and Lorelei, finally concluded that Lusamin is the largest, followed by Lorelei, then Cynthia, true bird, and finally M Of course, Yi Bei is not talking about the amount of milk, but is comparing the ages of women in the 20s and 70s. At the same time, rumbling, the battle platform under the two people's feet shook for a while, and began to rise like a lifting platform, finally, the battle platform rises to a height high enough to overlook the entire battle arena, period, Yi Bei didn't show surprise, he looked left and right, the calm look made Giovanni nod secretly, Yi Bei's tolerance is far beyond ordinary people, maybe we can consider Yi Bei through this battle, if Yi Bei shows enough talent to be absorbed by the rockets, Giovanni doesn't mind a combination of grace and power, let you be I see how powerful the rockets really are. Then, the challenge rule of Vicky Panjim is single battle, and each side can send three Pokemon to participate in the battle. Makoto declared the battle rules. As the gym master, Giovanni will be the first to send out the Pokemon to join the battle. But before Giovanni sent Pokemon, 
Yi Bei I stopped him. I hope to challenge Mr. Giovanni's starting lineup. What? A trace of astonishment flashed across Giovanni's calm and prestige face. Is this serious? On the referee's seat, Zeni I was stunned and almost staggered and fell from the high platform. Located in the gymnasium, a monitoring room, as the Rockets executive, Ariana and Archer looked at each other, looked at each other. In the end, Ariana, who is a woman, spoke first. TSK TSK, this kid is too self-conscious. Snort. Archer also shook his head amusedly as the strongest executive of the Rockets, fighting wits and courage with Yulongda for more than 10 years, all the first team Pokemon under his command have champion level abilities, for the power of Giovanni, it can be said that he has the deepest understanding, boss Giovanni wants to beat him, you don't even need to send the strongest trump card under your command, you only need to send the weakest existence in the main lineup, you can complete the 1v6 crushing victory in a short time, this kind of thing has long been spread within the Rockets, Giovanni's prestige has thus become unshakable, therefore, According to Ariana and Archer, Yi Bei I is a brat, and he wants to challenge the main force of the boss of their family. He is simply lost in his mind. What kind of cat or dog would dare to touch Master Porcelain? Archer sneered. A few words immediately attracted Ariana and several staff members in the monitoring room to burst into laughter. Indeed, in their view, at Yi Bei I's words, Jane laughed back. However, to the astonishment of Archer and Ariana, after meeting Yi Bei I's eyes, Giovanni nodded unexpectedly and actually took a Pokeball from his waist. Go, Rhyperia. Rhyperia is a ground plus rock type Pokemon, evolved from Rhydon carrying Protector. With 535, it is slightly stronger than Uzantia's species strength. Excellent attack, defense, and physical strength are his advantages. In stark contrast to this, Rhyperia's speed and special defense are low, and he is not good at facing fast special attackers. Unfortunately, the Greninja that Yi Bei is going to send is just a fast attacker with strong speed and special attack. Question mark Rhyperia? Ground plus rock ability, hard rock, received a move with excellent effect, reducing one quarter of the damage it should have suffered. Talent, orange. Question mark level, 92? Perhaps. The level 91 Pokemon has not fully mastered the power of the master level. But level 92 is totally different although it is also the beginning of the master level, but has been in this realm for a long time, you can fully display your master level combat power. In addition to ability hard rock, it can reduce the power of powerful moves. This battle was not as easy as imagined. Come on, Greninja. Yi Bei took out the dive ball and released his original partner, Greninja. Question mark Greninja. Water plus evil? Question mark Jing. Poison? Question mark ability. Bonding transform? Talent. Gold? Question mark level. 88. Carry. Mystic water. In two days. Yi Bei promoted Greninja from elite to champion. He has done his best to improve Greninja's strength, can be limited to rival only at level 80. Once you pass level 80, the speed of gaining experience will slow down so much so that Greninja has not been able to reach the master level. But, attributes, strengths, and fetters contest condition increases Greninja's chances of winning. Greninja, Carlos region's water system Uzangia. It is said that, this Greninja of yours can complete mega evolution without evolution stone. Looking at Greninja. Giovanni's eyes were full of curiosity. Even the real bird in the referee's seat looked at Greninja and eBay I with a hint of curiosity. Most of the Rockets executives have watched the videos on eBay I's social platform. I am very impressed with Greninja's handsome and explosive mega evolution. For a while, can't help but wonder about the outcome of the battle. Will the bondage ninja frog be the rival of Giovanni's boss? Super armor attack? This thought just popped into my mind. The real bird quickly shook his head. She was so pissed off by those three fools. No matter how handsome Greninja's Fetter Revolution is, what's the use? The level difference lies here. Yi Bei I is still too young after all. Breeder Pokemon have a limited time and experience too few battles to win. At the same time, monitoring room. See Yi Bei I sent Greninja, Archer and Ariana, who were still sniffing at the beginning, also became interested one after another. Archer muttered in doubt, is this the Greninja that can only Fetter Revolution? Listening to Greninja in the video surveillance, looking left and right, observing for a while, Ariana shook her head. It doesn't look any different than any other Greninja, which is weird. Interesting. I went to the scene. Let's see if there is a chance to see this guy's fet revolution with his own eyes, although there is a high probability that it will be dropped by the boss in seconds. Shrugging his shoulders, Archer walked out of the monitoring room and went straight to the third floor of Viking Gymnasium. There is a small balcony here. There is a colorful glass window above the balcony. There is a transparent lens, which can observe the external situation, and even has a magnifying effect. Through the front glass, Archer quietly observed the disturbances on the field. Soon, Ariana also came to Archer's side. The body is leaning against the wall, arms folded. How about it? The real bird guy seems to be distracted, and he hasn't started fighting yet. Wait, the boss's face is black, 
The guy is probably going to have his salary deducted. Archer gloated. Is there such a good thing? Ariana, who has always been jealous of the real bird's appearance value of 3.0, suddenly became interested when she heard that the real bird would be subject to punishment. Pulled Archer away, leaned against the glass, and watched the situation below. Ha ha, really? It's not easy to make this guy distracted at work, but one thing to say, the challenger named Yi Bei is really handsome. If it were me, I would also be distracted. It's just a pity, with the wax head of the silver gun. It is estimated that Greninger will lose soon. Ha, huh, just beat Greninger? Archer's expression turned cold, seems very dissatisfied with Ariana's evaluation. It's just a fledgling kid, you are too flattering him. I believe that the boss will soon complete one where three. How powerful the boss of Giovanni is, only he, Archer, knows best. Let alone a fledgling kid, even the Kanto Elite Four go together, but it's just a chicken and a dog. If there weren't many old monsters like Professor Oak peeping in the dark, maintain a balance of interests, will not sit back and watch the rockets overthrow Alliance. Even without the Mutuo plan, their rockets already dominate the Kanto region. Dot. Chapter 100 Dog Nambers Research Rain Tactics A real bird? Giovanni's deep, emotionless voice resounded in the ears of the real bird. The glasses girl's body trembled subconsciously. It's over, my salary will be deducted, and there will be no new bags this month. I'm sorry, Taja. After apologizing, the face of the real bird quickly becomes serious and professional, holding the referee's flag in hand. The challenger strikes first, and the competition begins. Flag in hand, Greninja. Water Shuriken, Rhyperia is known to be a heavyweight rival with excellent defense. It is usually easier to use quick attack or extreme speed to start the game. In this game, it was a wrong choice. Once Rhyperia hugs the crispy Greninja, it's easy to recreate Ash's fight against the Bean. The ending of Ryolu being restrained and defeated by the Octopus Warrior. Yibei I chose to use long range attack to test first. Greninja's body was in a half squatting position, with sharp eyes firmly locked on lock on Rhyperia. Throw out five shurikens constructed with water elemental energy, the shuriken flew across the air, and the extremely fast rotation brought a strong wind, exuding a sharp breath that made the scalp tingle, and went straight to the Rhyperia. Stone Edge, Rhyperia's hands turned khaki, and he slammed down on the ground, boom, a loud bang came out, oh three, then the thick and sharp rock blades broke through the ground one by one, and went straight to where Greninja was, along the way, attack intersection. Water shuriken slices the rock's blade that it touches horizontally, after cutting five rock blades in a row. The energy was exhausted and disappeared without a trace. Rumble. The huge rock fell to the ground, and at the same time as a burst of dust was splashed, a loud noise from the rock tackle ground resumed it. Water shuriken is offset. But rock blades are still coming out of the ground continuously, coming straight to Greninja. Get out of the way. As early as the moment rock's sharp blade appeared, Yibei I had already issued an order to shift positions. Therefore, Greninja easily moved laterally to Rhyperia's front left. Rock's sharp blade fell through without accident. Can cut through Rhyperia's rock blade? Archer was stunned and felt extremely incredible. This is the Rhyperia at the beginning of the master class. Could it be that Yibei I's Greninja has the strength of a champion? How can this be? Yibei I rookie. Why did he train Earl Dervish Pokemon to become a champion within a year? Where did so many high level rivals come to level him up? It's perfect. The talent of this Greninja is comparable to the Pokemon in Legendary. In the shadows behind the two, at some point, a mysterious man wearing a Team Rocket uniform with his facial features hidden under a peaked cap walked out. Man holding tablet. The screen played on the tablet is exactly the real-time battle screen provided by the monitor. Who? Ariana looked vigilantly at the man in the shadows, and touched the poke ball on her waist with her fingers. It's me. The mysterious man raised his head. A familiar but unfamiliar face appeared to Archer and Ariana. Proton, are you a human or a ghost? Ariana exclaimed, and immediately wanted to open the poke ball, etc. Thoughtful. Archer stretched out his hand to hold the stressed Ariana. Calm down Ariana, it's God. Zizazu, you have detected my disguise so quickly, you are worthy of Master Archer. Talking room. The man took off the peaked cap on his head and threw it aside, stretched his hand under his chin, and lifted off the human skin mask on his face, revealing a somewhat wretched face. Also one of the Rocket's executives, Lam is known for being good at camouflage. You bastard. Why are you here? Ariana gritted her teeth and glared at Petrel who had made her fool of herself. Could it be? Dr. Namba has made a breakthrough in his research on Kyoga and Lugia. Archer looked curious. No, I won't be needed the temporarily, so I'll come back and have a look. On the other hand, that guy Bixias seemed to have made some serious discovery and went to Chengdu alone. Seeing that Archer seemed very interested, Petrel raised his eyebrows and shrugged. I asked him, and he said nothing. That guy has become more and more power trip recently, and even us high-level executives don't pay attention to him. Lord Archer, should you find a time and teach him a lesson? Although everyone is executive and belongs to an organization, but they are all members of evil organizations, it is also very common for there to be a good temper, 
friction between each other, and hope to kill each other. Although Archer is also an executive, he is almost equivalent to a person under one person and above 10,000 people, and he is the deputy leader after Giovanni. If you can use Archer's hand to get rid of Bishes who is annoying him, Petrol feels that he can maintain a good mood for at least a week, let's watch the game. Archer's heart is like a mirror. Only if these people are hostile to each other, will they not threaten themselves. I didn't pay attention to the meaning of Petrol's archfire at all. At the same time, Giovanni was also surprised by Greninja's performance. Under normal conditions, it can actually cut the stone edge of the Master Rhyperia. This Greninja is estimated to be at least a champion. Yi Bei I, a rookie, was able to train like an Earl Dervish Pokemon to the champion level in a short period of time. This level of talent is simply terrifying. For a moment, Giovanni looked at Yi Bei I full of appreciation and greed. Anyway, such a genius must be included in the rockets, otherwise, it can only be erased. In Giovanni's heart, a strong killing intent emerged. Rain Dance, Hydro Pump. This is Yi Bei I's last attempt. In the first round of fighting, Yi Bei I captured a lot of information vertical bar 357. For example, Giovanni doesn't seem to bother letting Rhyperia dodge. This gives Yi Bei I a lot of room to maneuver. But if the Hydro Pump in a rainy day cannot cause heavy damage to the super armor attack, then it can only fetch revolution. Rain dance. Giovanni showed puzzled eyes, wondering why Yi Bei I would make such an order. Ha ha ha, this guy has a brain problem, right? Using the skill rain dance in the battle, is he planning to ask for a heavy rainstorm, so that the rain will attack the super armor crazy star? Compared to Giovanni who was mainly puzzled, Ariana didn't think so much and laughed on the spot. Rain dance. This commander dot 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 is it really a trainer who has collected all seven badges? Can it be made? Archer looks weird. I was surprised by Yi Bei I's performance. But I gave him such a surprise backhand, it really opened his eyes. Where is Yi Bei Dang? The scene of the fire? But it doesn't matter anymore, regardless of whether this scene is staged or not. The final victor will only be the boss of Giovanni. It's reckless to have such a powerful Greninja follow such a fool. Petrol shook his head in disgust, looking into Greninja's eyes. But full of greed, such a Pokemon with unlimited potential would be perfect if it belonged to him. Petrol's brain was running fast, and he began to plan how to take Snatch Greninja from Yi Bei I for himself. Dot. If you like this audiobook, subscribe the channel for more videos like this. And join my Patreon if you want to support me, link in the description. Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story, or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook. I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.